All right. How's it going? How's it going, everyone? We can talk over this we're music live. for a bit. We are live. Thanks for that build up. Feel like we're putting on the Joe Exotic show, like Jacob was saying yeah. earlier. We are the Joe Exotic of uh, YouTube, I guess. Should I let the song play out? I can't even hear the song. No, you can't. But they can't on the I show. Know. Who can hear the song? What song is this? <laughs> kind of got to let the song play out. It's almost done. Here's the outro part. Okay. Ready? I'll trust you. Uh, you're, you changed my screen just so, so you know. How's everyone doing? Oh man, these comments are getting flooded. All right, the song is done. Today we're going to be doing reviewing your cars, which you guys submitted yesterday on Instagram. We had, I think, like 500 submissions. I only managed to get through about 200 of them. So we're going to rank them from good to medium good to so good. Yeah, and as you can see, it's brought to you by Continental, and there is no recommended tire for today because we are staying home. Yes, stay home. Okay, you ready to start Continental this? Continental recommends that you stay home as well. Are you ready to start this off? Oh, I'm ready. Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? So, Jacob, I won't be able to see the chat while this is going on, so you're going to need to uh, keep up for the chat for me. Let okay. me know what anyone's saying. Well, maybe I, maybe I could show it on my left. Oh. One, one second, we already have a super chat. <laughs> okay. Uh, so 2019 Honda Civic Type R Agent Blue, love the show. It is a cool car, but there, there's, we're ranking, there's, there's one, we're in, there's one in there. There's one in there to rank. We're, we're, we are ranking the cars. You could use super chats to get crazy stuff that you want to say out there and then use the super chats if you disagree with our rankings. Okay, okay? and then our rankings go like this. So we've got good on the left. That's pretty much how we'd feel about good. Medium, you know, you get the little shrug. And so good, it's like a full launch control. So let me just... There's the reactions. You know, good. turn those down a bit, Medium just so good. you know what's up. Okay. So good. Are you guys ready for the first car for us to rank? Who's ready? Let me hear in the chat. Too late. Oh, people look, people look pretty excited. Okay. First off, we have Noitz 05 BMW 325i. Where are we going to put it, Jacob? Uh, Looks like he's got some aftermarket headlights in there. Like, mm, I'm going to put it mm, towards good. Towards good. So between good and medium good. Yes. All right. Let's start this off right Let us here. know in the comments if you guys disagree or agree. Okay. Next car we have. Don't just, don't just start yelling names out, the, out there because we can't get to just the name. <laughs> also, there's a delay. Yes. So we have Richard's 14 Cayman PDK, which he bought on our recommendation. That, okay, PDK, that is cool. It is a Cayman, that is cool. Mm, let's put it medium good, in between medium good and so good. Yeah, you, I agree. You agree. Yeah, yeah. Okay, all so right. by the way, I've seen all these before. I had to go through everything. So Jacob hasn't seen any of these, and I know what's going on. Yeah. So um, I'll, I'll, I might, I might let Jacob have a little bit more push on where they go because I fixed the system. Not fix the system, set it up. Uh, Steven said, thank you for the quality content. Thank you. And there's other... Super chats, but I can't get to those because, oh boy, 2017 Elantra Sport. I missed the Insta post. Well, thank you. That is a cool car. I will get. Uh, we'll get everything else yeah. later. We got to focus. There is, on this there is an Elantra Sport in there. Okay, next okay. we have Spencer's 2014 Jetta Sport TDI with a six-speed manual. So we have a manual okay. wagon. So manual wagon, super cool. Uh, close to so good, I think. But you said TDI, right? Yeah. Okay, so after the whole Dieselgate thing, TDI is kind of not cool anymore. So I'm gonna bump them over to the good side. So let's put them, I guess, kind of similar to the yeah, BMW. Yeah. That looks fair. All right. Uh, next we have another Spencer. Uh, this sorted itself alphabetically, and I tried to jumble it up, but there's gonna be a lot of similar names next to each other. He has a 17 BMW M240i in manual. That is gonna be a medium good for me, I think. Medium it's not good. Not quite an M2. I'll put it. Yeah, I'll yeah. put it to the left of the uh, Cayman. Left of the Cayman, yes. But that's a good one. That's a good spec. So like right here for now. Then we have, uh, Zhi Zhang has a Audi RS3. RS3, that is cool. Uh, auto. No, only. it's not cool. It's either good, medium good, or so good. 
You're right. My bad. Uh, that's going to be with the Cayman for me, I think. Okay. Uh, I'll put that next to the Cayman as well. How do you Medium got? good to so good. Okay. Let's take a one second break. How's everybody liking this? Is it easy to keep up with? Is it fun? Do you guys like I'm the fact? A lot of people agreeing and disagreeing. Do you guys like the fact that I managed to come up with like a green screen? Like, look at this. Yeah, I got a green screen as well over here. How uh, impressive is that? <laughs> mine's mine's an old towel. <laughs> people are liking it or no? I can't help. I can't see. Um, I don't know. People are people are talking like crazy. Um, how do we submit our cars? Go to Instagram, oh, you yeah. guys can get in on the next one. So Instagram, uh, Jacob will post when it's time to submit your cars. And anyone who submitted it this time that we're not doing today, I'll put together right when I'm done this for the next one, because I think we're gonna do more of these. Yeah, so submit your super chats uh, for disagreements if you really have a grievance with where we rank something. Yeah, or if, <laughs> yeah especially if it's your car, if you're like, no, my car yeah. needs to go up, we'll, we'll take bribes. Okay, next one. Zach, uh, you all are awesome. You guys should rate the cars you have done. Okay, we'll, we'll get to that yeah. stuff after. <laughs> okay, Zach has a 2001 supercharged Firebird. However, it is a 3.8 V6 that he supercharged. Oh, V6. And I'm not okay. sure about the transmission. I was going to say, it's, I'm, mm, it's, the, if he the went thing to the is, lengths of... He supercharged of it, and exactly. a Firebird is cooler than most stuff. Like, yeah. I would probably put that... It's a weird one. Near, I'm going to put it... Near the 240i, I think. Yeah, exactly. Because it's like the effort of the car. Do you know what I mean? Yes, exactly. Yeah. Okay. That's going right around here. Next, we have VJ's 09 Infinity G30, the G37S, which I think I looks think... super hot. So do I. Um, I don't yeah, know. I think that's... But these, these only have automatic, right? Uh, no. Those no? came in manual as well. Okay. Oh, it's the Infinity that only comes in um, the new no, Infinity. No, that is. Yes, the the new Q50s or whatever. I'm gonna assume um, this is in manual. So am I, and he's got cool wheels on it, good stance. I'm gonna give him a medium good. I'm gonna add that with a Firebird life. Well, I mean that's a little cooler than a Firebird. Maybe I'll, I'll overlap it here. Let me just answer Tony's question really quickly. Hey, Yuri and Jacob, do you like Rolls Royce baby blue interior? Uh, as long as it's not done by Mansory, I do like it. And oh, Yuri, I'm sure love it, it, love it, love it. Okay, are you ready for the next, next one? one? Oh, I'm ready. We've got Vic with his 2000 Mercedes ML320. Now, I think that's pretty cool, and it looks very clean. I'm going with good. I mean, that's... If it was an AMG, I'd bump it up. That's a solid good. It's a good. It's a very solid good. Okay. Uh, you like how I set up all these shortcuts to make these things smaller with just one click? That's great. Man, uh, we, great job, we, we, the amount of effort we put into this, guys. Oh, my God. Yeah, guys, we've, we spent like three days trying to put this together. All right, next car. Sorry, guys. Um, we have another V name. We have a Victor with a 2018 Volkswagen Sport Wagon in manual. I believe he has all track wheels on it, or at least different wheels. He's got the Golf I, I R like wheels. It looks like the Golf R wheels. Ah, he, I like it a lot. Should we put, I'm, we I'm should put this to the right of the diesel wagon, I think. 100%. Like right here, right? I would even put that a little bit higher. A little higher here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So up and down, uh, me, up and down isn't really a ranking system yet. I think it's just left and right. Left and right, but then when it comes to the, <laughs> um, I guess the stuff on the right, that's when it'll really matter. Yeah, let me just get to this question quickly. Uh, yeah, for making pretty good on my Cayman. Uh, Q curbed impression, no points for beige interior. You're kidding, guys, keep it up. Any mods to get, get it to so good. Okay, Yuri, you got to move the Cayman because we were bribed. So you got to move the Cayman over. Thank you, we accept bribes. We this accept bribes. I'll make, I'll make your thumbnail a little bigger, too. <laughs> this is how no, the times works. are tough. We don't have cars to review. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, next. Are, are we good? Are we good to... Um, yeah. Okay, we uh, have... Let, yeah, yeah, let's do this one, and then I got another super uh, chat. Va Vache, I'm sure, pretty sure that's how we said to pronounce it. Uh, a 2019 Alfa Romeo Giulia. However, it is not a Quadrifoglio. Still a really sexy-looking car. And he's got the good uh, wheels. He has the good wheels. I'm, I'm putting like that better than an RS3. Same here, for sure. So that'll Even though it's not the quad. come over here. Yeah, I'm good with that. Let me just get the super chat. Uh, your review of the GLA 45 and influenced my decision in purchasing one. Curious on your thoughts of it currently, some years on now. Still really like it. Yeah. 
uh, GLA 45 is still a cool car. Of course. Oh yeah, yeah. I saw it on the road, and yeah. I was like, I'm like, the guy had it all blacked out with just the wing, and I'm like, that's yeah. how you do like a sleeper car. You know what I mean? Oh, I know. Is my Dacia Sandero cool, or Dacia? It's the comfort one. I don't know what that looks like, but James May seems to love it. So yes. Okay. Next, we have a. Ooh. a I forget the. I don't think the guy gave his name. He's got a Civic Type R that he tracks, and he says he can keep up with Corvettes until they screw up. And then he sent me a picture of it with the front end crashed, and then he got the money from track insurance. That's going to so good. <laughs> okay, yeah, so yeah. So good. I mean, the Civic Type R was like really, really fun. So let's add that right around here somewhere. Yeah, it's in the so good. Don't take the, the, the minute differences too seriously. Yeah, it's yeah. hard to like figure <laughs> that out. And I think at the very end, we've got about 175 cars. We're going to rank our top five as the top five yeah. winners of the session. And I think we'll just keep doing this because it's actually a lot of fun. Yeah, this is really fun. Okay, Tyler and Meg have an 86300ZX. ZX. That's, that's really cool. Is it twin turbo? Or is uh, it single turbo? I don't or know. Is it even turbo? I, I don't know, but... Is it even manual? The fact that it still exists. Yeah. And that, like they've got nice, that, nice photos of it. I'm going to give that... I'm going to put that medium good. Uh, okay, I am controlling it, so I'm going to add it a little bit to the right of medium good. Next one, we have a uh, Tyler, no, Sven has a 2013 Volkswagen Touareg TDI, and he is overlanding it, I think. Okay. Anything with a uh, tent is, is overland, a, right? Yes, anything with a rooftop tent is overlanding, so I'm going to put that into... How, how about the right between side? Between good of, and... Oh, yeah? Between good and medium good. Okay. I think that's a nice, think. That's a nice spot. Yeah, yeah. Uh, let me just get the super chat quickly. You guys are awesome. Y'all inspired me to get my Focus ST. Yo, that is a fun car. Hopefully, we got a Focus ST. Yeah, system. yeah. No, we got we got a couple of those. Okay, ready? All right. Thank you. Yep. Tyler has an 09 Pontiac G5 and looks like a two door. Um, uh, that's good to me. So, uh, any any car <laughs> that anyone who watches our channel has is at least good. That's our yes. rule. So definitely, we don't want to roast cars. But, you know, some yeah, cars are just definitely. good. They're, that's a good car. We really yeah, like yeah. the SS Cobalt. There's a good, I mean, there's a medium gooder version of it. <laughs> All right, here. Now we have a Zach's 2019 Civic Type R in blue. Okay, we got to put that to the left of the other Civic Type R because he didn't include tracking details. Yes, he hasn't crashed it yet. Yeah, definitely so good, though. I'll put it, I'll put it right up here so they're kind of even. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's fair. Next, we've got Tyler with an 04 Mini Cooper S. That is between medium good and so good, I think. You? Me, yeah. Uh, I was going to go just straight middle medium good. I, I'm good with that. Because I don't know if that's manual. I don't know if he's done anything to it. Yeah. But I feel like that's a we solid medium make, good. We do have to make some assumptions. We've yeah. got to assume our viewers would have manuals. Oh, here we go. Okay, so uh, Tudor has a 1990 Miata, and, you know, I like it. He's also rocking some Pelotis right now that he got from our coupon we, code. I think we got to put him to so good. It is a Miata. Yeah, oh, there's a lot, there's a lot of Miatas coming up. Oh, God. Okay, 1990. <laughs> well, I mean, it's kind of the best car from our race thing, so let's give it, that. It is really good. Let's give that. I'll put it on the edge because a Miata is always the answer, but you can always make faster Miatas. Yeah, I'll put it in yeah. the middle of both. Oh, hang on, Yuri. Uh, the Z31 had a single turbo. Okay, so that 300ZX, mm -hmm. we got to bump that up because we've been bribed, and it also has a turbo, so that is even cooler. Yep, right there. Okay, thank you very and much. You get, a bigger, you get a bigger thumbnail, too. Romero, that's how it works. Romero? I think it was Tyler and Meg. Well, Romero said the Z31 had a single turbo. So. What's the Z31? Is that 300ZX? Yeah, it's a it's a model designation like the Z thirty two, Z thirty three. Oh, like the Z twenty eight Cavalier. Uh, not quite. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Moving on. Next car. Yash has a two thousand two Honda Accord V six. My mom had one of these cars, so I really like it. I mean, it's very reliable. It's, I'm gonna put that. It's definitely good to medium good. Yeah, it's halfway through good. I think. Yes. I like oh, it. Oh, we got another. We got another one. Uh, Claude. You guys are great. Hope I didn't send my AMG pics in too late. Here's a bribe that you guys can get some more ice driving lessons. Kidding, you guys are pretty good. All Cheers. right, all right. You know, uh, okay, since Claude just answered that, I see in four we have Claude's okay, submission. Okay, Claude. Oh, 
Oh, okay. So this is we know that this is Claude's submission. We met him at the Mercedes Ice Driving uh, Academy. So Claude, Claude has a, a GT 63S and a GTR Pro. Uh, that's that's off the charts. So good. Yeah. Like I mean, Claude, so you know, far you're, you're winning. I think I will give that. You also bribed us. You also bribed us. Okay. So let me uh, increase the <laughs> thumbnail size and wow, add that Claude. at the top right right now. AMG GTR Pro. We haven't even driven one of those yet. I think I need a. I don't know how much more I can increase these thumbnails. We'll probably run out of space. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that, that's really good. Okay, that's uh, definitely have, the coolest thing so far. Let me just get to the super chat. I've gone from a Pontiac G8 GT, which was totaled by a drunk driver, to a 17 Mustang GT, to a 2024 runner. Roast, rate my poor financial decisions. Actually, you made really good decisions nope, on all your cars. No issues with your decisions. All right, you ready for the next yeah. one? Great job. So uh, this yes, is Zach's 2018 GTI. This is Zach from the Wings and Slicks uh, Stunt School. Ah, so he knows how to drive as well. He said, he said you could roast my car all you want, but you guys sat in it and approved it. So yeah, we got to give that. There's no need to roast it. We got to that, give that between... a medium good and so good. Exactly. But any other GTIs will probably go a little bit less because, you know. Yeah. Oh, people in the comments saying Claude just won. I mean, Claude is winning right now. You know what That's though? I've I've seen I've seen the lineup. Claude's is pretty good, but. Oh, <laughs> Claude's is pretty good. <laughs> this is gonna get real good. Okay. Uh, we've got Trey with an 09 Mazda Speed 3. I have come around to really liking these. Uh, what, okay, do you, what do you think? He's got RPF ones on it. He's got a really good stance. I like what this guy is doing. So this guy is definitely uh, a medium good. It's better than the GT. The better than a stock GTI. 100%. Okay, so it's going right here, right next to Zach's. Yeah, good job. Okay, Trevor. Uh, one quick super chat. Uh, my my 4Runner TRD Pro is better than every car on this list. I mean, it's a TRD we have Pro we have very, we have a couple good. 400 TRD Pros on this list, so your car you go, will man. help bribe their cars. Thanks for the bribe, Brooks. Okay, uh, we have a uh, 2001 C270 CDI. Mm, I believe that's a diesel, so that is a wagon. From, from uh, it is definitely from Europe. The guy's name white. it's Trevor. Uh, I mean, Europe does like diesels, but diesels, I don't really like them. I'm going to throw this next to this. Uh, it's a cool car, but like it's not like yes. that cool. It, if the number is only a, cool a two, like, I feel like the numbers go a lot higher than two. So, like, you know. Yes. Um, one super chat. Uh, 2010 Saab 95 Aero NG XWD. Dude, I don't even know. We, what we, have, we, have, we have something like that coming up. Okay. okay. Uh, sorry, Revan. I don't have answers on that because I don't know what that car is exactly. But the Saab 95 is cool. Go for it. Okay, next we have Tony who drives his i8 in the winter. So that is, that is so, so good. good. Yep. I mean, the doors go up. No matter what anyone says about the up, i8, that's like such a wicked car. It is. Uh, so we'll if get, I said anything bad about it, I regret it. I'm going to put it right around here, okay? That's, that's good. Dead center, so good. Okay, so Tom has a 2017 Holden VF uh, Calius or something, VLS3 V8 in Australia. Oh, dude, that's so good. That is that is Jacob's 100%. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's my man right there. So we need to learn more about these cars. Maybe if we do an Australia trip, it'll all be reviews on these. But yeah, that's, once we that's, can travel, we're giving them a so good. Right next to the okay. i8. Hang on, we got, we got two super chats. Uh, also, sent my late entry R26 Megane in yellow, not available in Canada. So we probably don't have no, that. Depending, that will on how be late in one it. of the upcoming videos. We'll do more of these because this is super it's actually fun. a lot and of fun. Then, yeah. <laughs> We got another one. Uh, hand me down for my father, 87 928 S4 5 MT. That is cool, and you bribed us, so that is double cool. Okay, keep going. Okay, we have Timor with a 2017 Subaru BRZ, and he told me I should get a Subaru BRZ, which he's also correct. Uh, Subaru uh, BRZ like he, is definitely as cool as a Miata. Yes, and it looks like he modded it, and he's got a little tow hook on the front. That's definitely as cool as a Miata, I'd say. Okay. Uh, maybe a little cooler than an old... Well, I'll put it, I'll put it next to the well, Type R, or between the Type I R would, and the Miata. I'd put it like to the left of that a little bit, but yeah, yeah, that's perfect. Just a little. Uh, hang on. Uh, oh, hope my car made it. Love the content. Keep it up. I don't know what your car is. Yo, but if I your car didn't make well. this round, it'll make the next round. Like going through this, I need to take the photo from Instagram, uh, upload it, find out what yeah. your name and the model <laughs> is, type it in, bring it into Photoshop, line it all up, close them all, and then open them all. It's a lot of work, but yeah. And then instead of uh, shortcuts for resizing, it'll be good. It'll be good. Late old school Lotus submission just sent in. We will probably get to it. We're next gonna, we're gonna do next time. Like Trust me, there'll be more videos. And Hang on, there's there's more super chats. Hang on, let me just get to these real, real quick. 
2018 uh, BMW F30 340i xDrive, six-speed manual, mineral gray, red leather, last likely ever 6MT all-wheel drive BMW. Super cool. Super cool. Very, yeah, yeah, of course. Uh, which car do you think is cooler? Tesla Model S P100D or Dodge Charger Hellcat? Similar to 0 to 60. Uh, Hellcat's cooler. Hellcat's just yeah. cooler. I mean, P100D Hellcats. is cool if you're techie, but like Hellcat's yeah. cooler for everything. 100%. All right, Yuri, go on. Okay, we have Paul with a 2019 Subaru WRX. It has a roof rack, and it looks lower. It's got cool wheels and a different logo That's, on the front. He's got some clean mods. Uh, I'm good with that. I, I'd put that in a medium good. Medium good. Is that not cooler than a BRZ? Oh, I guess it's kind of not. I, we like the BRZ no, more. I'm going to put it exactly. right next to the uh, G37. Yeah, I'm good with that. Uh, we have Ooh. Vivek with a 2010 Audi A5. Co hmm. Coupe, two-door. I think that's that's a, five. that's a solid uh, like medium good. I think I'm gonna go with yeah somewhere around yeah, if here. If it was an S, I would have bumped it over. A um, couple super chats. The BRZ is not is so not better than the GTI. Uh, we got we got bribed on that one, Yuri. The BRZ is not better than the GTI. Yeah, refund that guy's money. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll, uh -huh. I'll move the BRZ over a little bit, but. Uh, I tried to refund your super chat. I'm just kidding. Okay, Sam has an '86 uh, Toyota pickup four x four. That is off road. That is between medium good and so good. I think. Yeah, I like that. I think that's really cool. It's TRD. It looks super clean. I like it. Let's uh, go. Let me just get the super chat while you do that. Uh, when I waited for delivery, my C43 wagon. I literally watch your video every day, dude. That's awesome. And congratulations on your C43 yeah, wagon. Yeah, submit that for the next one. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Let me get to these. Uh, review for the S63 Coupe, we would love to. Uh, do you have a Ford Flex coming? We have nothing coming right now because we can't review anything, which is why we're doing why, this, why, this is super fun. Why we're doing Yuri and Jacob's Joe Exotic <laughs> live stream. Okay. Uh, wait, wait. Uh, last one. 20, 2011 is Chevy Cruze, straight piped. I mean, you straight piped it, but it's still a Ford <laughs> cylinder. Uh... Okay, okay. Ready? Yuri, go on. Okay, yeah. Steven has an O2 Nissan Xterra that's supercharged and has a five-speed and he's off-roading it in the photo. That's that's bordering on so good. That's what I'm saying. Remember the yellow if ones? It was, if it was yellow, yeah. exactly. Okay. Yeah. So we like you, that. You lose points for not getting in yellow. So we're going to put it uh, bordering so good. Yes. I'm okay with that. All right. Uh, Shabazz has a 2019 Durango GT. Mm. It doesn't have the hood scoop, which it's, means that's it's not RT. the SRT. Yeah, because uh, yeah. I, I say RT, that's, yeah. that's definitely medium good. Middle of medium good. Yeah, yeah. I like it. It is cool. It's cooler than most three rows or whatever. Or is that Ooh. a two row? Okay, this is a... Um, Sean is this has thing a, on bags? Sean has a 2003 GTI VR6. Oh, that is... That is... I'm going to say between medium good and so good. Yeah, I also agree. He asked... I asked him, like, send... He didn't send a proof that it was his car, but then his whole Instagram was just this car. So, <laughs> like, it's all, all good. Right. I got you. That makes sense. Uh, okay, let's go to um, Sean has an 06 G35 Coupe. Okay, so a couple things I noticed right away. It doesn't have the Brembos. It's got the smaller wheels, so I'm assuming this doesn't actually – this might be manual, but I'm thinking it's auto because I wanted one of these so badly that I researched and drove a uh, test drove a couple of them. I'm going to put this, because of this spec, between good and medium good. If this was like the Brembo spec and, and had everything, I would put it closer Yo, to Yeah, but that's a solid car to have. I mean, like... It is. It really is. is it, yeah, but we don't know if it's automatic or manual. That's the thing. Exactly. I, I'm, I'm judging it by the wheels. You guys got to start and telling us. Yeah, yeah, it's okay. Uh, okay. What do you think of the 2020 Porsche 911 Turbo S? Uh, quickly, we were supposed to drive that at Laguna Seca, but then this whole situation around the world happened, and the event was canceled, so we didn't get to drive it. I'm slightly A5 bitter a about it. <laughs> oh, you're... Yeah, so am I. Uh, A5 has a catback exhaust with gunmetal tips also. Okay, so that red A5 you put into medium good. He bribed us. That needs to get moved over. Oh, I'm, I'm moving it. Let's, yeah. let's, give okay. it a, uh, let's give it a... Yeah, that's good. That's good. I'm trying to find a nice spot for it. Oh, I think you're overlapping. Oh, I am. All right. Yeah, yeah, that's good. That's good. I'm going to have to start shrinking stuff in a bit. All right, Vivek, that's how bribes work. Oh my God, we're the worst. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Do you have a Ford Flex coming on the good wall? Uh, yeah, 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 there's one, there's one. Well, hang on. Uh, my Xterra, factory supercharger, went from driving a 2002 Focus uh, SVT 2005 BMW 325Ci to Xterra. I mean, that is cool. We've already placed that. I don't know if that was yours. Is that considered a bribe? 
I think so. I'll bribe we it. we got to move it over. I'll bribe it a bit. Well, we're going to bribe that one because we're not sure if that's actually yours. You did say my Xterra, though, so okay. we're bribing. Yeah. Uh, uh, your quick thoughts on the new Volvo S60 R design. Uh, watch our video. Unless, yeah. Okay, let, let, okay. how about two Super Chats okay. per um, me putting okay, out a okay. riff? Okay, go go we have... Uh, Sarath ah. has a 05 Saab 92X, which is the Sabaru. Yes, that is the Sabaru. Uh, that is definitely between medium good and so good. Oh, why am I trying to shrink it manually? My bad. Medium good and all so good. good. Uh, okay, yeah. man, that's like, I feel like good to medium it, good. It's a, man, it's a manual all-wheel drive turbo wagon, and it's not diesel. And it's a Saab. I'm going to have to slowly move medium good over, <laughs> just, just so we could fit more stuff in the medium good section. Uh, 2017 Q50 Red Sport. Okay, that wasn't really a question. We already reviewed that, I'm pretty sure, unless we did the... No, we did the Q50. Um, All right, guys, we're, we're expanding the medium good to so good section just because... Uh, you guys have some cool cars. Uh, thoughts on 2006 Chevy Tahoe? I don't really have any thoughts on it. I mean, it's Tahoe. It's pretty cool. No thoughts. Okay, we have uh, Shane... Thoughts on LS Swap? Wait, wait, sorry, one more. Thoughts on LS Swap on 2019 CRV future plans? LS Swap everything. Yeah. I don't care... How many people in the world hate that? Just LS swap everything. Okay, go for it. You ready? Shane has a '93 Mazda MX-6, which I used to think was lame. Uh, I think they're really cool now, so I'm gonna give that personally the top end of medium good. Uh, I would have ranked it lower, but all right. All right, we can add that. I, I, it's cool. I did want, I did want a Ford Probe at one point, so that is basically there, the same and thing. Since medium good has moved around, now your car is not necessarily ranked against other cars near it. We're doing our best. This is literally yeah. so much harder than I thought it would be. Okay, Spencer. Uh, 2017. Uh, Spencer has 20, a. Just, just give me a gap between you get to the next car because we got super chats. Okay. 2017 ZL1 manual dark red 199 bribe. I mean, you didn't have to bribe us. That's a cool car. <laughs> okay, Spencer has it. a 16 Mazda 3, which I think he made look perfect. Remember, I didn't like this generation. This is cool. Yeah, I th I think it's all right. I would put that at medium good. Yeah, next to Closer next to a good. GTI. Mm, I would put that lower. Next to the MX-6? Yes, yes. Okay. Yes. Okay, Sean has a 2017 Ooh. Hyundai Elantra Sport, and it goes he's pop, got pop. A, Yeah, he's got a, it looks like he's got a bigger intercooler there. Um, that's, that's definitely medium good, if not higher. Would you take this over a GTI? Mm, I mean, this one's modded. Like, over a stock GTI? Over Zach's GTI, know. right here, right here. Yeah, that that's that's where I would put that. That is that is cool. Okay, is good. Robbie has a 2010 manual GTI. Looks stock, has nice wheels just like mine. Since I'm a fan of GTIs, I think I'll throw that. Well, I mean, my my GTI is good, but I don't really care about it. I'm I'm gonna throw well, that. Very good GTIs. Yeah, yeah. I throw that right around there. here. Okay, next super chat, Camaro, 2017, 50th anniversary, 2SS. Bought this car last year. You can check it out. Uh, check more for it on Insta at 250 at 52 ss love you guys um i'm sure that's a pretty cool car we actually haven't been able to review a v8 camaro yet uh i have a red 2013 red accurate i have a red 2013 red accurate tsx special edition i mean that that seems all right <laughs> all right you go for it so there we have a yeah. quinn with a 17 shelby gt350 which obviously goes right to the edge of so good yes it does no questions asked no, so we'll it's not even the R, but it doesn't even matter. No, it doesn't. So, uh-oh. Uh oh, there it went. Got another super chat from Mahan. Uh, 2017 Porsche 911 C2. Oh, damn, dude, that's so cool. Okay, Yeah. Sam has an 82 Mazda RX-7 in blue. That's so mm -hmm. good, for sure, bro. Yeah, that is so it's good. It's got the cool, like, uh, four, it's got four, the four spoke. spoke wheels, yeah, the yeah, plus yeah, signs. Yeah. Uh, which do I send in my 18 Raptor or $700 project? Honestly, probably your $700 project. I, I like the Raptor and everybody knows that. So I want the oddball. Okay. Noah has a 2016 Volvo V60 Polestar. So these are the coolest versions of this wagon, I think. But then again, there are like the V70R was also really cool, but this is a Polestar. So this is the coolest Polestar. I'm going to put that so good. Okay. And this is Noah from our club. Oh, sick. Okay. Uh, next is Ted has a 2000 Lexus LX470, and it has a bike rack on the back, a roof rack, a snorkel. And we met uh, Ted at the Continental booth at SEMA. Remember, he took that photo 
of us, like with us on the side while everyone else is doing the live video. Yep, that is going straight over to so good. Yeah, love those wheels, love that setup. He also he also submitted another Lexus, but I figured this one was a little bit cooler. Yeah, yeah that that's good. Um, Romero, have it like Top Gear, where if those three own that car, it's uncool, dude. I don't even remember. I don't know how many cars those guys have owned, so I, we can't really do that. And Yuri and I's rules yeah. are if we own it, it's it's cool. It's so. even cooler. Okay, so yeah. Oscar has a 2000 MR2 Ooh. Spider, which is the kind that I really like the most. So I'm good, and he's tracking it. So I want to put that in here. So good. I, I'm good with that. Okay, that yeah, that like is an that. awesome one. Let's put that uh, right Carrie. in here. 2019 Mercedes S560 Cabriolet Exclusive Edition. Okay, that is super cool. Uh, wow, good for you, Carrie. That is that 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 would have been on our so good side. Okay. Also, you bribed us a lot. Jacob, you ready? I am. Ricardo has a 17 a 2017 Miata RF. It's our first mm, new Miata. Okay. Question is, is it going to be cooler than the, or or let is it going to be more so good than the soft top? I don't know. Uh, we'll find out, but I think it's cooler. I think it's more so good than an old Miata because like these drive yes. amazing. Yeah. So I'm gonna put that yeah, near I'm, the Type I'm, R. I'm good with that. Okay. Uh, next super chat. Ryan. Okay, you do you do yours. Yeah. Uh, 2010 Cadillac CTS wagon, 3.6 liter with the wood grain steering wheel. Okay, that is. I know it's a wagon. It's a CTS. That is medium good. If you had the V, that would have been off the charts. So good. Go for it, Yuri. We have um, Ryan with a '95 Mustang GT with what looks like a roof rack, but it doesn't look like it's actually attached. It looks like he just put it there for a photo with a towel. Yeah. But um, it is a Mustang GT, so I'm pretty stoked on that. I'm good with that. I think I would put that in medium good. All right. I like Mustangs. Uh, no. And uh, next medium good. Super chat. I have a 1979 Pontiac Trans Am Special Edition, black and gold. I'll send it in next time you guys do this. Uh, yeah, that's going to be off the charts so good. Mm -hmm. Go for it. Okay, um, sorry. We have Parker's G thirty seven S. I don't care. I'm gonna give I don't that care for this four door. Like that's just like a me oh, neither. Like, just give it a good. Give it a good. That's uh that's in there yeah. with the accord. <laughs> <laughs> uh love you guys. Come to Los Angeles and you can drive and review my twenty eighteen Camaro two SS. Uh we would love to go to Los Angeles. We would love to go outside of our houses actually. So <laughs> one day when we can do that again, that sounds like Yo, you you ready for this next one? Oh, Ryan dude. has a 93 Corrado VR6. That is that is so good. I'm assuming it's manual, VR6 and everything. Love the stance, love the wheels. I believe those are Borbits. Um, yeah, so good. This is All the way over. so good. I actually wish I could drive one of those. That's I've never so driven one, too. but like they're definitely so cool. Okay, mm -hmm. Mike has a Veloster N 2020, and he got a cool rolling shot like one of our thumbnails. Okay, he gets bonus points for the rolling shot um and it is an n i'm gonna give that so good it's gotta yeah, go next yeah. to the civic type r's because it's like exactly. you know the exactly. competitor. okay so ruan Ooh. has an 84 toyota hilux yo is this is this straya mate or is this ontario it looks like a blue and white plate at the front i huh. don't know <laughs> I, I like it a lot but i see oranges anyways i like it a lot i think, I think and everything. similar to the pathfinder and that uh yes. toyota 4x4 right yes yes uh, a couple super chats. I had a 1989 Toyota Supra Targa Mark III. What do you think about that car? Uh, that's super cool. Any Toyota Supra, the first one's a little weird, the first gen, but all the other gens after that are like really nice. Okay. Uh, so that is super cool. Noah has a 2013 Civic Si. Um, I didn't think Civic Si's were cool until I drove a Civic Si. I assume this one's pretty fun. It's got the weird front end that didn't last long. Yeah, and, he, and it's a coupe, though, so he gets points for that. Um, I, I, would I would give that a medium. I would put that at least near this uh, Mazda 3. Yes. Or maybe a little yes. less. I, I would, yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right. Yeah, but that Mustang uh, GT nice. needs to go, uh, the Mustang GT is cooler yeah. than a Mazda 3, so. Not yeah. that these matter, uh, we just, we're just doing our best. Okay, we have Mike. With on, let me. Okay, go, okay. you go ahead. Uh, did you guys see our 84 300 TD Turbo or our 88 Carrera? Yuri, did you see those? I don't know. No, I think that's so the next one. We went through. I think that's the next one. Um, 15 red M235i uh, rear-wheel drive manual, not an M2, but still cool. It's definitely still cool, but it's just not M2 cool. But you did get the rear-wheel drive Okay, one. I'm going wow. again. Okay, you ready? Go for it. There's a lot more Super Chat. Mike has a 2012 Subaru Outback. I'm going to put that at good. Yes. Yes, you are. <laughs> Uh-oh. Where'd that go? Uh, got a... Uh-oh. Is that off the charts uh, good? Uh-oh. You're, you're, you're undoing a lot of stuff. 
I gotta find where it went. Okay, I'm gonna get these super chats while you fix okay. that. Okay. Uh, got a 68 Impala fastback that I'm half asked for storing with a 454 big block that I rebuilt. Hopefully it's done by the next time you see this. Well, I hope you do get that done because that sounds really cool. Also, if you guys are using this time to fix up all your projects, I would highly recommend this time to do that. 2016 oh, Chrysler 300 C all wheel drive. Uh, because it's a C, that is pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Um, welcome to upcoming videos. Sweet. Yeah. You guys can also join as a YouTube member and get some uh, bonus stuff. Okay. Uh, thanks for showing my Veloster N. Oh, dude, we just got bribed for the Veloster N. Oh, That's got to get moved. Taking the bribes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to run out of bribe space. Uh, one more super chat. Should I go APR stage three on my 2015 Volkswagen CC Sport? It is a six speed manual. Yes. Uh, the CC, I think, is one of the best looking Volkswagens okay. uh, ever made. You ready? Go for it. Yep. Ravi has a 1936 Chevy half ton. I'm going to give that between medium good and so good. Yep, for sure. Like, that's really cool, but like, I don't, exactly. I don't have any appreciation for classic cars. Besides, I really like them. Yeah, like I appreciate that he's doing stuff about it and it looks pretty clean, but yeah, I'm just like personally not into that. Like I'm into it, but I just don't know. I don't know how to appreciate it. Just like I didn't appreciate front wheel drive cars until I got to drive a ton of them. Yeah. Okay, uh, let's go. 2016 Ford Fiesta ST. Yes, that is a super cool car that we haven't actually driven yet. Yeah. Did you see my Skoda Superb IV? Someone is asking. There, Ivan. I, there is. Is his name Ivan? Oh, yes. Okay, just remind me to bribe that. <laughs> okay, this is oh my Nate's 2012 Impreza. <laughs> uh, I mean, he sent it to you, which means he's still alive. So let's give him a medium good. Yeah, right here. <laughs> yeah. Okay, next is uh, Matthew with a 2016 Dodge Grand Caravan. I mean, I really like it, but when we look at the whole chart. Yeah. But like, I would definitely yeah, put that above like um, an Outback. Yeah, I would put that above that Outback, yes. Oh, it looks like it's got the... Oh, it's raised. I think it's an accessible vehicle, too. It, that's what I was looking at. I'm like, I think it is. I couldn't tell. That, I'm like, there's a side skirt on that. All right, we'll add that right up here. Uh, the 95 Mustang GT is a manual, full exhaust and headers, coilovers, cold air intake, bigger throttle body. Okay, Yuri, if you can find that I found uh, 95 it. Mustang. All right. Bribe, the bribe has bribe. been accepted. Yeah, that is... Uh, I mean... It's a legitimate bribe because he also gave us way more information, which is full exhaust and headers and coilovers. So. Okay, we have another Noah with another cool <laughs> Volvo wagon. Uh, this one is an 09 V50 T5 R design. Okay, that is that is between medium good and so good. I'm all right with that, dude. I'm running out yeah. of space. I'm gonna have to. You're gonna I, have to. You're gonna have to answer questions for a minute while I just like uh, <laughs> yeah. reposition something. Uh, Lexus IS 350 or the Q50 Red Sport, which one to buy? Okay, if you want straight line horsepower and I think arguably better looks, go for the Q50 Red Sport. If you want presumed reliability, IS 350, but it's not going to be as exciting. Uh, but it does, I think, handle a little better and it has better steering. So I don't know. Kind of pick your one between that. Yo, I, have, I don't remember the interior on the Red Sport. I either. just need one more minute to like fix this so that I don't they, they both have equally terrible infotainment so I can tell you that much uh, how many uh, questions do you have my, to answer I got one more okay. uh, is my 1982 Dodge D 150 slant 5 with a manual cool yes it is but it's yes, not it's it not in this list but it might be in the next one okay you ready Jacob I am ready uh, with a no name we have a 17 Audi s3 okay so you got to put it with the other s3 or was that an RS3? You got to put it to the left of the RS3. Of the yeah. RS, yeah. Okay, where's the RS3 up here? So let's just add this with uh, medium it's good. It's a medium good, yeah. That's definitely better than a Mazda MX-6. <laughs> yes. Okay. Uh, 2013 Alex Acura has... ILX. Oh, you, Sorry. you go ahead. Uh, 2013 Acura ILX 2.4 6MT. Um, because you got a manual, that is pretty cool. And yeah, you still got VTEC, I believe, in that one. So yeah, that's cool. Go for it. Okay, Alex has a 20... 2007 Honda Accord Coupe. I feel like, and it's got, okay, it's got lights, it's got wheels, the stance isn't fixed, but I feel like the Goose had one of these too, didn't he? I don't remember. Uh, I do like these coupes, but I I don't know if I agree with this choice of uh, headlights on this one. The wheels are okay. Yeah. The stance does need to be fixed. Overall, I'm gonna I think that's medium good. good. Would you, uh, okay. Would you take this over a stock G35? Uh, I, I wouldn't. Okay, so I'm putting it left of the G35, but I'm moving the G35 over. That's a good spot for it. 
Guys, I'm doing my best to not be mean to your cars. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Let me just uh, get another beverage. Okay, so Andrew has a 2018 Alfa Romeo Giulia Ti Sport, uh, not a Quadrifoglio. I think we have to just put that next to the other Alfa Romeo. You do, but the other one was blue, and I like the blue one a little bit more, so you've got to put on the left of the blue but one. But I like these Alphas. That is really nice. Uh, I want one of those. Okay. Like Clarkson said, you're not a proper gearhead unless you've owned an Alpha, so. Yeah, well, it must be nice to have BBC money. <laughs> Alphas? You know what I mean? I, like, I could be able to afford one. Yeah. Jeez, okay. Uh, this is Andrew with a 2018 Alpha. Nope, wrong one. This is, I don't have the name for this. This is an 09 Tacoma okay. TRD, and it has general grabbers on it. Okay, that is definitely uh, between medium good and so good. Uh, 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 uh. It gets bonus points for the for the grabbers. I know we are we are um, so easily bribed. Yeah, yeah. Except by manufacturers, we don't take any manufacturers' money. Uh, why does America get get the BMW 3 Series GT? I have it and I love it. I don't know. Oh. I, I, I don't okay, know. here we go. What? Yep. No. Ayub has a Lamborghini Murcielago with a manual. He I asked him for proof. Buddy, buddy sent me a nice message and showed it to me sitting covered in his uh in his yard i'm speechless uh, that's what i'm saying remember what i said there's some heavy hitters coming up yeah wow these are these are actual legitimate subscriber cards that we have verified yeah no i i he sent me a he sent me a very nice message that that's off the charts so i'm uh, i'm gonna throw that's this so good. like see that's what i'm saying this is kind of better than the gtr pro i think yeah 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 but the GTR Pros, uh, yeah, no, yeah, we're working out. We're trying to figure it out. Yeah, yeah, we'll figure this out. Uh, have you got? Hope you guys like the Challenger I sent Erie. That's Dakota. If you remember Dakota and Challenger. That's not in this one. I don't. G seventy or Stinger GT two. Stinger. You ready, Jacob? It. Yes. Okay. Anthony's fifteen JCW. This is uh, Choo Choo on GT Sport. Hmm. Uh, I'm gonna give that a medium good. I'm gonna, but I did really enjoy my time. That is a JCW. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna go like closer to the so good. Yeah, that's good. All right, that was a that's a really fun car. That was that started the whole like pop pop thing for us. After that, we're the pop pop. Well, that and the M40i, I think. Yeah, some people in the comments saying Ayub wins. Yeah, people are saying they're going nuts over that. Yeah, yeah, obviously. That's good job, man. All right. Uh, uh, Bo Boicho, I'm not Boico, I'm not really sure how to pronounce this, but he has an 84 Lada 2105. Um, it's so bad that it's so good. I'm going to give that a solid medium. I, I think so, man. Maybe a little, uh, I don't know a little to the right of medium. That. Anything Lada kind of gets bonus points just because it's a Lada. I should be playing the funny. Borat music while I yeah. rank that one. Put it in H. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It runs on kerosene. <laughs> Anthony with a 2019 Kia Stinger GT2. Okay, that's uh, that's between medium good and so good. That's a solid car. Can't go wrong with it. Yeah, I love the Stinger. Okay, we have a Volvo S60R. I'm gonna, if it was a wagon, I would have given this so good. So put it at medium good, I think. There. Yeah, that's we good. have a uh, favorite favorite car under two thousand US three thousand CAD. Also review my RX eight. Uh, favorite know, car reliable, under two thousand US. I don't know, man. Whatever. Uh, reliable runs. Civic. Like I don't. Yeah, exactly. well, you know what? Like, I got my two, my first two, my only two forty SX for thirty five hundred Canadian. Uh, I am sure that yeah. kind of price doesn't exist for him anymore, but you know. Exactly. I got my Fox Body Mustang GT for around that price. So just find something with a V eight in around that. Oh, uh, get a Crown Vic. For that price, yeah. There, Jacob, save it for the uh, save the Crown Vic Go for the it. ranking. Okay, <laughs> yeah. uh, 2012 Audi S4. Let's throw that with the other S4. I think. Yes, I agree. Uh, he does have like the black optics package where he did black it out. So yeah. Where's the other one? Like right uh, around here. Mark Seven R looks versus Mark Seven and a Half looks. Honestly, I have to see them side by side because, I mean, to me they're so subtle. Yo, that, there's definitely a difference. You know, there's but... so many cars that exist. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, Jacob, yeah. this is this is a good one. This is a 2017 Ford Everest Trend, and uh, it's Australian. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's just a Ford Ranger. Yeah, I, I think it's a Ford Ranger as an SUV. Yeah. Um, I'm going to give that a good. Good. Because yeah, it's like the Ford Ranger we weren't too stoked on. 
No, we weren't. It's not a raptor, at least not yet. But it, and I also don't know if it's good or not. Like that might be like considered not a cool car over there. Yeah, but exactly. But it is interesting. 2010 Lincoln MKZ. Uh, that's okay. If you got the Continental, I mean, it's a little bit newer, but I'm gonna give that an A. Are you ready, Jacob? I am. Adam has a 14 Juke Nismo. Which okay. I really like. If that license plate, the license plate is Jukey. I don't know if that's Photoshop or not, but I've always liked the Juke Nismo, and no matter what you say, it's getting a little bit of a bump. Uh, because it's a Nismo, it gets a bump. It is hideous, but it's also manual, I believe. So yeah, that that's fair. I'm gonna Look, give I'll, that. Oh, whoa, that far? That's what I'm saying, man. Okay, oh left God. left of the stinger. Yeah, okay, okay left yeah, of the stinger. yeah, come on. Let's, let's be real here. All right, so adverb here with the uh, 2013 Audi uh, A8. Okay, um, he's put really nice wheels on it, and it's a V8, so I'm good with all of that. Okay, where yeah, does it go, I, though? I would, put, I would put that between medium good and so good. Okay, that'll be, I guess, right here. Man, we need to really extend the... Yeah. <laughs> We got we got to be more brutal on this. No, but everyone's got such oh, cool cars. Man. Okay, this is a uh, Benjamin with a '98 Benz C200. C200. I'm gonna give that like it's a classic, and I wanted one of those at one point. I'm gonna give that a medium. Yo, game. everybody take a shot every time Jacob said he looked at buying one of those or wanted one of those or checked one of those out. Good luck surviving, everyone. That's what I'm saying. Okay, next we have a uh, CJ with an '08 Audi A4. <laughs> wagon. Uh, sorry, I just read a comment saying Yuri's ranking of that juke made me leave. <laughs> yeah, well, you can bribe the you can bribe cars down as well. I don't care. Yeah. Um, sorry, what was that d details of this car again? Uh, uh, CJ has an 08 Audi A4. Uh, it's an A. It is a wagon though. Let's give it a medium good. He's got wheels on it too with a decent stance. So let's give it a right of all the Jettas. Okay. Like the Jetta wagons. Yo, how's everybody liking the um, the quality? Is it good? Yeah. Because I've been try we've been trying to make it good. I think our first stream we tried like a week ago was trash. Yep. Um, this looks better to us, and we have uh, we don't have backgrounds because we're super special like that. So. <laughs> okay, we have a 2018 Honda Civic LX hatch, and it's a manual. I didn't get the guy's name, but he wanted to make sure. He, he was asking if the video will stay up because he can't watch it live. So, okay. I mean, that's a gonna, solid car. I'm going to give him a good. It is a solid car. Yeah. I'm going to give him a good, though. It's giving a good, but it is like, if you need it to get to work, it would be good. Yeah. Okay. Uh, this is Vic with the ML. It'll be considerably cooler once I get another car, but since you guys are taking bribes, now it works too. Love you guys. Wait, wh okay. what's moving? What's the ML, the, the Mercedes ML, I believe it was silver. Yeah, oh, I got it. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Wow, that's a, that's no. a bribe and a half. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, there you go, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> Look, man, I like my bribes. Oh, quality is so good. Quality's been good. Rather exquisite, sir. All right, good. Yo, uh, big shout out to that's... Andy the Lab on YouTube for helping me out with some of my computer issues. So everyone, follow Andy the Lab on YouTube. Great reviews. Better filming than I think us. We've kind of like we've kind <laughs> yeah, of just like, stopped doing all the effects and stuff, and she's just going hard with the effects. Uh, let me just get this. Yo, you, you get that, and I'm going to top up my uh, refreshment. Go for it. Okay, so hope you guys like my 2013 Mustang I sent in. Hasn't lost a street race. <laughs> okay, don't be street racing, but I'm sure we'll probably like your 2013 Mustang. I assume it's a GT. Um, review my black on black 2019 Durango SRT. We've already done the Durango SRT, and we really liked it. So black on black, that's, that's almost even cooler. Uh, 2020 Porsche Cayenne e-hybrid. We've already reviewed that car. Um, if I was to place it on this chart, I would probably put it... Mm, I would put it at medium good. Yeah. Uh, people asking how to submit stuff now. Uh, it's too late for this round, um, but if you go to Instagram here, I'll, I'll post the link right now. Read all of the instructions at that link on that post. Read all of the instructions. Don't miss a single instruction, or else you will not get your car submitted. So just go to that link right now. Uh, we're going to do this again because we're having a lot of fun doing it. So just just follow the instructions there, and then we'll just keep submitting them for the next ones. Uh, my Volvo V50 is a 6MT with a turbo i5, by the way, bribe. Oh, man, Noah, 
Wow, what color was yours? Uh, the V50. Yuri? Yuri! <laughs> uh, I can't move stuff. Only Yuri can move stuff. Hello. Oh. Okay, Yuri, we just got bribed. I'll take it. <laughs> you, 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 you have to find the, the Volvo. It was a, it was a wagon. Uh, which one? What was the name? I, uh, Noah. I know. Sure. No, yeah. no, he's already Noah at the. the he's already near the top. That's that's our Noah from yeah, our club. He, no. Is it? There's two Noahs. No. With wagons. That's, one of them's a V50. I got it. I got it. It's got to be that one. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I rec Perfect. I recognize the location of this photo. Is it IKEA? No, no. Well, no. Um, uh, hey guys, just passing through. Traded in the Fiat 500 for a Fiat 500X. I mean, I assume you needed more room, so that's good. All but right, I yeah, think yeah. the Fiat 500 is cooler. Next one, next one. Uh, sorry, everything takes a second. Uh, okay, you ready for this one? Oh, this is a doozy. Uh-oh, sorry, my, my scrolling kept going. Um, I'm waiting. 2007 Opel Zafira. That is... That is on the left side of the charts, Yuri. It's, it's like a Saturn, I think. It's like a Saturn. That's left side of the chart, please. But, you know. <laughs> it, it, Just put it on the left side of the chart and move on. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. I like how, I like how the bottom is this uh, G. I, I would put it lefter of that with the other <laughs> Pontiac. Yeah, I just feel like just off of it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, so, uh, sent in my 2005 Mini, hoping to see it soon. All right, Denison. We hope to see. Oh, what is this? This is a 2003 Volkswagen Lupo GTI that was imported from Japan and lives in Kelowna, British Columbia. That's going so good. That's what I'm saying. I think. Yeah. Uh oh. Uh, okay, a couple more super chats. I like that you a have... lot. It looks cool. From yeah, the, ba that, the that back cool. shot, looked really cool as well. Uh, you have 100k of buying power, but it has to be pre 2010. Can be as old as you want. Will not be your only car. Can be modified. What do you do? Buy prowlers. Mm. Yeah, uh, that's that's really tough. Uh, pre 2010. There's so many good cars pre 2010. Um, prowler, 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 prowler. What what year did the LFA came out? No, LFA was like later. Um, I don't even know. I I would buy a fox body and make it into a drag car that can also drift. Just something so stupid that shouldn't exist. Okay, Chris has a 2019 Camaro ZL1 1LE. He's also got a number on the side, which means he's at the racetrack. So I'm thinking that's so good, even though we haven't. What did we drive on the track? Didn't we drive it on the track? Oh yeah, we drove it once. That would, yeah, I, was, I remember being very surprised by it. So I'm gonna give it a so good. Yeah, uh, I'll uh, put it. A little, I'll put it a little bit. To, well, no, that that Veloster and was bribed. So yeah. Uh, M two thirty five I is definitely not as cool as M two, but I bought it used with thirty k miles for the price of a Civic Sport. Also traded a Civic to get it. Love it. Well, that that is definitely cooler than a Civic Sport. So congratulations. Is that the one that's on our wall? Uh, let's assume it is. If you want to move it over. What was the guy's name? Uh, Jacob. Jacob with an M two thirty five I. No, that this this M two forty this was an M two forty I. Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay yeah. so we have Brian with his nineteen Type R, which I think will slot in with the rest of the nice Type Rs. Yes, it does. And I think he said this was taken at his engineering school, so shout out that. Yeah. Uh, oh, also Nicholas. Yeah, you're right. Uh, LFI is not a thousand dollars. I don't know why I was thinking that. Okay, we have Brian. Nope. We have a Jose with a nineteen sixty Volkswagen Beetle. That's. I mean, I think that's the, it's cool. the classic car territory that we can't appreciate. Well, no, we've driven it. It's cool. It's yeah, cool we, that you keep it up. Yeah, exactly. And, and it's in such good shape. I'm going to give that's that. A, that's a solid, yeah, yeah. That's a solid between medium good and so good. Okay, now we have Chris with a 2006 Nissan 350Z, which I'm putting near so good. Maybe we'll underneath the S. Uh, what's with that bumper, though? I what's... love this bumper. I feel like this is the one from Fast and Furious, bro. I don't know. I, I'm not a fan of that bumper. I like the wheels. All right, Jacob, where do you want to put it? I would put that medium good. All personally. right, sounds good. <laughs> it's going to so good. I don't care. I love that. That's the bumper I'm going to get when I get my uh, oh, 350Z. No. Okay, we have um, Charles with a 91 Toyota MR2 Turbo. Okay, that is so good. Mm -hmm. That's cool. I haven't driven I mean, one, but it looks like it would be I a know, lot of fun. You know, pop-up headlights. 
everything about it. Cool. Yeah, let me know uh, if these cool. things start like interfering with my uh, where I am, and I can just move myself out. Uh, Le Mans Blue C6 Z06, one of 99. <laughs> I know what I have. <laughs> that, that's a good one. Uh, C6 Z06 is very good value. That is definitely pretty cool. Uh, I have an idea, Jacob. What if I what's your idea, uh, um, flip myself horizontally and come over here with you? Each other? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I got to move my Instagram thing over too. Here. Uh, cheers. I was going to cheers you. Okay, hold on, hold on. I can't see. Let me get to that screen. Uh, here, cheers. Cheers. <laughs> okay. Um, this... Now, people might assume that we're at the same house, which we're not. No, we're That's definitely not. That's the part. Because uh, uh, you people shouldn't be going outside. Nobody should be going outside right now unless you're a frontline worker or an essential worker. Okay, some people said leave it that way, so just leave it this way. Go for it. No, I am, I am. I just got to do something. I got to make a joke. Okay. Uh, yeah, people are making jokes about not social distancing and six feet apart, Yuri. Yeah, no, I'm... These I'm, are the times that we live in. I'm working on it. I have... My joke is, is in the making. I just... <laughs> okay, I believe you. I believe you. Just give me a minute. All right. Okay, but let me know when I get it right. That looks so uncomfortable. Don't worry, guys. We're literally, like almost 100 kilometers apart, so like 62 miles Jacob, apart. Jacob, do you see that? Uh, I see six, yeah, I do, I do. Six feet. Uh, let me just move it over a bit more. Yeah. There. That's good? Uh, I can't see it yet. Oh yeah, that's good, that's good. Okay. Um, <laughs> next car. We have Alex with a 19 two liter turbo Camaro 1 LT. Hmm. Mm. I'm just gonna give that a good. No, isn't one LT supposed to be fun, fast, or is every two liter turbo one LT? Well, it's a two liter turbo. Like, why would you get a two liter turbo Camaro? You get the V8. I know, but like, all right, I'm gonna. Yeah, I'm, you, just, you get the V8. Uh oh. Is everything back to normal? Yes. Let me check. Yes. Okay, uh, I'm gaming that. Okay. I personally think it should go a little bit more. Like, I would take that over. Would you take that over a GTI? Uh, exactly. Whatever. I mean, I'm, yeah. I'll, put it, I'll I put it to medium good. Yeah, okay. Next, we have Brian with a 2016 IS 200T F Sport. And uh, he took offense to the latest video where you said F Sports aren't real F Sports. Yeah, well, he's going back into medium good. <laughs> but that does look how, that looks really good. It does look good. Like it it's a really good looking car. It's got black wheels on it and stuff, but not a, not just, a real F Sport, not a real F. Okay. We have Alex with a 2019 Kia Niro EV. <laughs> I'm going to give that a good. I'm going to give that on the writer side of good. Yeah. If this was like an environmental only channel then like that would kill right now i'm sure it would and all these other cars would be not off the charts <laughs> okay we have bruno with a renault clio sport uh the way he parked it is i think hilarious yeah um i'm gonna give that a good i don't know anything about it i'm just judging it by its looks did you just post a link to instagram in the comments I did so that people people keep asking how to submit it, and I just posted okay. The hold link on, I can add post. a I can add a little thing to submit your car. Follow us on Insta. Oh man, this is so much smarter. Uh, apparently, our names are potentially hiding stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got but that it. still doesn't. They're not going to go straight to the the post, and they're going to just randomly submit things without following the rules, Yuri. The follow no Insta. Look, man, I'm doing Photoshop with a green oh, screen. Oh, I know. Uh, I know you are. Uh, let me just get to the super chat. Man, Thanks for rating my Elantra Sport. Also bought a 2019 Santa Fe 2.0T Ultimate as well for a daily. Hope you guys are staying safe. Well, we are staying safe, so thank you for that. Um, Santa Fe is pretty sweet as well. The only thing I didn't like about that car was the the transmission. I remember it being like just down a gear always. So yeah, anyways. And I really uh, like the Santa Fe. I, I had that over Christmas break, and I felt like that was my car. But you, 
But that was a bribe, so we got to move his Elantra Sport up. I believe that was the blue one with the intercooler, kind of in the middle of medium good. So that just got a bribe. Yeah, yeah, that's exactly where it should be. I'm I'm okay with the bribes. I don't like unless it's a car manufacturer. We don't take bribes from them. <laughs> Actually, we don't take we only take bribes from you guys. Everyone else is just a paid partnership. But we yeah, won't do paid exactly. partnership from manufacturers. Okay. No. no. Let me get the next car. We have. Andrew with a 2015 Volkswagen TSI. Uh, that, it's not a GTI. That's definitely it, good. It, it's good. It's no Renault Clio, but... <laughs> and it's no GTI. Okay, you ready for this next one? Yes. Uh, oh, what's this guy's name? Kale or Cake? Uh, I forget. But he's got a 1998 Ooh. Corvette with a really cool green color. Kind of like the thumbnail of our latest uh, Corvette video review. That's got to be a wrap or paint. Regardless, I like it. That's uh, that's on the right side of medium good to so good. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna put that to the uh, right here. Like, I would yeah, rather have yeah, that yeah. over an MR2, I think, or like mm, that or a Civic Sorry, Type your, R. Your audio cuts out a little bit. That or um, a Civic Type R. Oh, I'd take that for sure. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. Uh, now we've got Caleb with a 2013 Mustang V6 with a performance package. Put that with the other Camaro with the four-cylinder turbo. Okay, where, where was that one? <laughs> it's a V6. If it was a V8, obviously it would have been moved over. But I can't uh, even find V6. it. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Uh, now we have Carter with the 2004 Audi A4 manual, which it looks like he took the photo with a potato camera. But <laughs> I kind of like it. I, I, I think I, that was the Audi that I liked the looks of the most. Yeah, but it's not an S, so. Uh... That's not even a wagon either. Let's give that a good to medium good. Right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's just as good as a crashed Impreza. <laughs> yeah. Okay, Christian with a 2015 Fiesta ST. I feel like we um, met this guy at one of the meetups. I don't know, but he's got a lip kit. He's got cool wheels, looks lowered. Definitely so good. So good. Uh, let's put it right here. Yeah. Uh, next, we have Eric. Oh, with... so, somebody just said, oh, it's Kale. The Corvette Kale. is factory paint. Wow. Okay. That's, that's pretty epic. Wait, did he just tell you that the Corvette was factory paint in a super chat? It wasn't a super chat. I just happened to see it. Well, so he, it happens, he happens to get a bribe there. That's not a real bribe, but I'll take I, it. I, I just that. made it bigger. Okay. Same spot. Okay. Now yeah. we have Eric with an 06 S60R. He said one of eight manuals in North America. And he's got the cool interior. Yep. Okay, so that's cooler than the other um s60r that we had earlier which i don't recall where we put it by the way there's a lot of this stuff that i don't have notes on i just remember a lot from this i'm a very visual person <laughs> and like yeah yeah okay let's uh, throw this F up here where's the other volvos uh i well that's cooler than the other one but i, I don't see it right now the other one yeah, yeah is, that's a good spot for it. yeah i'll take that um f sports are reals yo and yuri still looks like steven seagal all right that's the well, guy that's Ryan the guy is, Brian just paid to call you Steven Seagal. That's so his F sport. That's his F sport, man. Uh, I know. I'm just saying. Yeah, no, we need to bribe him up. Where is it? <laughs> um, it was the one with the black wheels. It was silver, I believe. Man, it's so hard to find stuff once you put it somewhere. It's silver in a driveway somewhere. Yeah, there it is. I recall. Yeah. Okay. We accept bribes. We are not below. We are not above bribes. <laughs> F sport are real. Okay. Um, oh, man, we got a lot of people here. I just looked. There's well, like almost 2,000 people here right now. This is awesome. Yeah, if it was Lady Gaga, she'd probably have more. Probably. Oh, I think I need to brighten up my uh, camera. How about you? Uh, I don't know. My you tell me. My, my green screen is, uh, I think, fading a bit. Oh. Um, checked out the Juke Nismo on WinWiki. Oh, uh, it, it is a stick. That's the actual license plate. Props for Minnesota, and they drive the heck out of it. Even took it to Canada. Bump that up. Oh man, I don't know if Arthur just paid for somebody else's Juke Nismo to be bumped up. It's getting but bumped. That is definitely that's that's getting bumped with pleasure. That's cool. Uh, I'm glad you guys are using uh, WinWiki too, because uh, Ed Bullion seems to have done a good job with that. Where did so, it come from? Go. I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna put it right next to the Fiesta ST. Yeah, yeah. I'm running out of room, guys, with all these bumps. Yeah, okay, yeah. Uh, sorry. Let's get back to it. Brandon has a 17 Nissan Maxima. Uh, that's definitely good. That's definitely good. It has a floating roof. Yeah, I don't know. It's cool, though. 
it, it's it's good. I'd probably yeah. take that over that weird Ford. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh. Uh, Claudio has a 2011 BMW M3. Uh, do you know if it's manual or not? I am not sure. Regardless, that's the one with the V8. Uh, so, okay, so funny story quickly. Savage Geese uh, owned that one, and that's the one that was always broken for. Uh, so that kind of makes it. E- yeah, yeah, yeah. That that makes it even cooler. Going under the Corvette. Up with that. All right, yeah. our next our next uh, entrance. Oh. It is Chris Fix's uh, Drift Stang. I've seen this thing in person. The job on the handbrake yes, was so clean. Um, I mean, that kind of has to hit the so good. Dude, that hits, that hits the so good. It's the Drift Stang. That is the drift thing. Thank you, Chris, for submitting. Yes, this. thank you. <laughs> uh, oh, where'd it go? Um, there it went. All right, let's follow Mr. Beast. Somebody just paid to say that. Follow Mr. Beast. Uh, my, br- my, yeah. My brother said the Nero EV placement was unfair. Okay, so Alex just paid for his brother to uh, get bumped up. What do you want? There you go. Medium good. I'll give you a medium good. There, there's a medium good. How's that? Uh, I gotta um, increase the thumbnail size. Oh, hang on. We got another bribe. Uh, the 2013 Mustang has a Borla exhaust system and 331 gearing. I also have a 1971 Corvette that's been handed down since new. Wow. You should have posted the Corvette. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Well, we did. We got to take that bribe now. Here, now the Nero is the same as the a V6 Mustang. Uh, I, I'm well, good that, with that. that. That's bribed. That's bribes right there. I, I, yeah, it is. I'm good with that. Okay. Uh, 2017 Accord V6 with a six-speed. You really can't, like, hate on that. You know what I mean? No, because it's a six-speed. And it looks is super it... weird, and it's a two-door. That's kind of, like, the last of it. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's... that's. A, I would almost give that a so good. Yeah, that's going to be the edge of medium good. Uh-oh, I pushed the yeah. wrong button again. Yes, you did. That's going right here, medium good. Uh, someone just asked, uh, will this be on your page after this? Yeah, this is staying up. I think so, because this is a huge success for us, at least. At least we feel like Yo, it honestly, is. Honestly, Jacob, we've, we've, only gone, is we've only gone through about half of them. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. This is, this is going to take forever. Uh, uh, sorry if I'm pronouncing it incorrectly. Benet has a 2006 Sentra SER, and I believe that was at our meetup, but I might be completely okay. wrong. Okay, so... Actually, it was regular I mean, car that, that meetup. Yeah, that parking lot looks really familiar. <laughs> it's weird to say that because I'm literally just looking at the pavement and the line markings. But um, I'm going to give that a, a medium good for sure. Because that's got the 3.5. I like that car. And it's got cool wheels. And they come stock like that. Dan um, has a 2018 oh Huracan Performante with a turbo kit. Now, when he submitted this, I told him, I'm like, I'm going to be honest with you. There's a cooler Lamborghini. So, uh, Jacob. Let's be real. But dude, dude, that is that's not a factory twin turbo. That's I know. A he, purple Monte that's been twin turbo. Yeah, he told me that he put it, he showed me the kit and everything too. I can see that. So uh, what do you think? That, Better than the Mercy? That, I would put that okay. equal. Okay, equal, equal. It's gotta be equal. Dude, look at that thing. Holy I I know, but like it's got paddles. People that watch this watch us have these cars? Wow. Okay. Uh, that is amazing. We just got bribed, by the way. By who? Not sure if I made the list, but my 2011 Jetta 2.5 IS manual, oh, is manual and a five cylinder for what it's worth. Oh, I don't, I don't think we did a regular Jetta yet. Mm. Yo, don't bribe us prior to the car because we don't know if it's going to be coming up, Jack. Yeah, Sorry. give me a second. I just got to blow my nose. Okay. Uh, what's your Canadian unobtainium? A car that is not sold in Canada. Do you guys get the Alpine uh, or cannot be imported currently? Um, we do not get Alpine or Alpine. Uh, that is a cool car. At least it seems pretty cool. Um, I really like all the Australian cars, um, but apparently they don't make a lot of those anymore. So I guess like Holden's and uh, Ford Falcons and stuff like that. I really like Australian utes of any kind, especially with V8s and stuff. But they also come with like five cylinders and turbos and stuff like that, like the Barra. I, I keep hearing Barra because of... Um, Mighty Car Mods. So Mighty Car Mods is a super sick show that I'm sure you guys watch as well. Cancel. Uh oh. Gary, did you almost erase this entire show? <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell. I'm gonna save this real quick. Uh, <laughs> see. Actually, should I even save it? Uh, probably not. Just, just don't exit. I'm not, yeah, that was, that was... If, if you exit, it looks like the show is over. I just wanted to. Uh, hold on. I just want to fix this part here. And also follow Yuri. That way people don't get confused thinking that the instructions are on my Instagram. 
Yes. Okay. Uh, I, Back to it or what? In this post. Yeah, go for it. Uh, let me find. Holy crap, man. Yo, this is like literally one, maybe one quarter of all the cars submitted. I believe it. We got a lot we'll of We'll just do this every day. Yeah. I don't care. Oh, wow. Okay, Dylan has a 92 Jeep Cherokee or whatever is left of it, he says. Dude, that is so good. <laughs> 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 all right let's put that wow. let's put that in the so good pile that gets us so good man anyone that wheels one of those things yeah dude we're running out uh i don't even know how we can accommodate this maybe i'll just overlap yeah. stuff and then maybe i'll i'll export a file that's longer you might have to okay curtis has a 2014 bmw 328i x drive wagon I'd give that a medium good. Mm. What if we start moving? Um, okay, I got an idea. Do you have any <laughs> questions you can answer for like a minute? I do not. I can read some regular chats. Okay, um, yeah, do that for like do that for like two minutes, and no problem. I will fix this. Man card on that Jeep? Yes, absolutely. I uh, hope they check my Accord out. I hope we do as well, and I hope you have a cool Accord. Um, this is so cool. Will this be a regular live stream? I think so. I think we'll do this it'll, like it'll be until pretty frequently. Actually, even after maybe because like this is fun. I th yeah. Let's. I mean, the setup is like a little bit intense. We gotta be. But, uh, we gotta be thankful see. that like we had time to figure this out. Oh, I know. Yeah, we had like three days to figure out how to do this. So, a hmm. uh, couple super chats. Number one fan. Oh man, thank you guys. Uh, I've got my super chat at the ready. Oh, that's funny. So people are people are getting their super chats ready just in case they don't like where we post their car uh -oh. <laughs> that's pretty funny yeah i mean that's a smart move okay hold on that is, that is. give me give me like three more minutes and i can solve everything no problem yo uh i gotta address this one jacob is anti-wagon person boo i am not but regular base wagons are are cool but they're not that cool so that's why they get put into the good medium good if you get like the super high performance stuff like the pole stars the ctsv wagons uh the s4 wagons the rs6 wagons those are all so good. I love wagons. Um, let's see here. Uh, old Ford Ranger thoughts. We actually reviewed that. That was one of the first cars that we drove. I didn't so mind that at all, but the Element was like almost as capable. Yeah, yeah. Except so I couldn't put it in rear-wheel drive mode. Watch our um, Ford Ranger review from like way back. It's very embarrassing, so I'm sure you guys will enjoy that now. It's not, well, yeah, no, it is. Well, watching like anything old for, for us now is like kind of embarrassing. Um, what do we have here? Uh, wow, there's some people just straight up spamming the chat that I can't read. Um, oh, here we go. Yo, do you guys think the prices of newer used cars will decrease in price due to COVID-19? I think everything is going to decrease for the most part. Um, new cars are going to stay the same because you can't really change that. Uh, used cars, at least the like super classics and the exotics will probably go down because the economy is also going down. So it's not like a direct result of that, but it's like an indirect result of all that. So I think, I think exotics are going to go way down and uh, classic cars because that's not what a lot of people buy regularly. You know, I would totally scoop up a sick classic car if it was like... So would I. Okay, you see, I, no, ma I made maybe even an exotic. I made a Joe exotic. I made some more Joe exotic. Yeah, <laughs> the more the more Joe exotics, the better. Oh, Yo, God, quick no. quick poll. Did Carol do it? Yes. Okay, um, uh, I I made room. I am ready for the next one. Jacob, 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 Jacob. All right. Uh, also, you misspelled my name, by the way. Just so you know. I did. No, no, I'm just telling that guy. Okay, give me one second. Six feet. Yeah, just so you guys know, we are actually, whoever joined us now, we're, we're at totally separate houses. We're like um, from each other. Uh, I'm at my house. Yuri's at his house. And Yuri has now moved himself over so that you guys don't think that we're actually together because we are definitely not. We have two completely different setups at two completely different houses. Yeah, I'm going uh, to hang out here for a bit. Yeah, go for it. Uh, you know, if you guys could just like not spam the chat no no spam the chat who cares okay next yeah, car there's like don't spam anything mean okay we're back dustin has a okay, 2019 six. golf r in the viper green look it's got continental tires on it and he bought it after watching our video 
Did he get? Did he say manual or auto? Or mm, DSG? I can check. And see. Anyways, I'll check. He, got, he got it. He got in Viper Green. Let's give him a medium good to so good. Let, let me just check. Let me just check. I'll ask him. Well, you got to do it quickly. Dust. Uh, I just bought a 2020 C43 AMG. Rate it, please. Um, Actually, uh, yeah. I would rate that at medium good because you didn't say you got the wagon. Uh, bribe. Hey guys, I love your channel chemistry between you guys. What do you think of the 2020 Audi S7? Are you planning to do a re review of, of it? So we really liked the A7. Yeah. So I'm assuming we're just going to like the S7 way more. So Guaranteed. that's a really cool car. Okay. Uh, back to it. We have, um, let's see, Ellis with a 2014 S3 hatchback. Looks like something we don't get in Canada. That's right. Let's put that pretty high up the list. Yeah, I think so. Uh, between medium good and so good, mostly because hey, we don't get that, and it just looks cool because it's got dual exhaust, yeah. dual quads. Daniel quads. has a 2003 Jeep TJ, and I think it had a special version, but I don't remember what it was. I mean, Jeeps are cool. Uh, not the best photo, so it's kind of hard to tell. I'm going to give him medium. He sent, he sent another photo, but I think this captured it better. And I didn't yeah. want to put anybody's faces in the photos, but uh, medium good. I'm, yeah, all right, I'll put that yeah. right. Put we that... did verify all of these photos that they are actually owned by okay. our subscribers. Because Here we, we also had to send a selfie with it. Daniel has a 2011 Saab 9.3. Okay, is this the person that also bribed us earlier? Because remember there was a Saab 9.3 previous bribe? Yeah, uh, I don't know if it's the exact same person. I don't know either. Let's give that a medium good though. Yeah. And give him a little bit of a bigger thumbnail, just a little bit. And in case, in case this is you who bribed us, just let us know, and I will. Yeah. So I will add so more, so add so more so bribes good. to it. <laughs> okay. Uh, Dan has a 2016 Mustang V6 convertible. So he went and bought a rental car. However, Jacob, you rented one of these, right? I did. Do, do you like it? I had a good time at it, but not the best time. So uh, um, compared to the cars on the list in the medium good area, where would you rank this? I would put it next to that uh, B, that V6 uh, Camaro or whatever it was, and four-cylinder Camaro. There we go. Or the Mustang, whatever it was, the V6 Mustang. There we go. Okay. Next on the list, we have Derek with a 2015 Forerunner TRD Pro, and he's got a wheel in the air. He's off-roading it in his photo. I mean... Yeah. That's a wicked photo. Uh, we were also previously bribed by someone else. Not that we really needed it. That's so good. Yep. And then let's let's add Yo, that right there. the air shots. Yeah, killed it. Okay. Colin has a 2018 Sear Ibiza Beats, and Beats stands for the audio system being by Beats. Oh, that's a Seat or whatever. Um, uh, is that what he said? Oh, maybe he spelled it. Maybe I yeah. maybe I re miswrote it. Anyways, it's a Seat. Seat. Yeah, that's what it is. I don't know what I was thinking. I don't know anything about that car, so strictly judging by that one photo, I'm going to give it a good. Mm. I don't really like it, to be honest. Looks like a... I think it looks okay. Okay. Dan... No, 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 sorry. Darren has a 2013 Hyundai Veloster. I think the photo is very cool. Um, so do I. To be honest, I think like the wheels are like subtle enough to be cool. I'm going to give that a medium good for sure. <sighs> I don't like the wheels. And you don't like the wheels? No. Okay. I'm going to put that I'm gonna put that here. Uh, love the channel. Into classic cars at all. Bought a 67 Imperial when I was 16. Did they sell Imperials in Canada? Yeah. I, I was looking at a Chrysler 300, or not a Chrysler Imperial convertible with my dad, but uh, turns out if you don't know anything about cars and you try to buy one, it kind of sucks. Yeah. <laughs> to, uh, try to fix stuff. Judging... That Judging by his uh, little display picture, uh, I think it looks pretty cool. So I think that's super cool. We are in, into classic cars, and hopefully we'll get some classic cars on the channel. <laughs> okay. Uh, we, we do want to get our own, but not like super classic. Yeah, you, re you ready for this next submission? I'm ready. Elise has a 19 Volkswagen GTI. I think this is our only fully female submission. The other one was the uh, 300 ZX. The joint, the, the joint female yes. and male one. So we have a regular old GTI with cool wheels. Let's add, yeah. that, add that to the GTIs. P put it with the GTIs. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. I think next time we might have to limit this to like 
not so many GTIs, even though so many people have GTIs. I mean, I don't want to be exclusive of anyone. That's that's the thing. Okay. Well, the thing is we might have to be because okay. it's just going to be filled with GTIs. Ali has a 2005 Miata LS. Now, I don't know if LS means LS swap. Uh, LS, I, I would assume so. See, I don't know. It's got a lot of, like, tires and stuff around it. Has there ever been... A Miata LS, like a model. No, I'm pretty sure that's an actual LS. Uh, give that a so good. Okay, we're gonna uh, assume gonna say, we're gonna assume that's yeah. an LS swap Miata. That's right. Yeah, I'll put it right here. Uh, Eric has an 08 Audi TT. That is definitely on the higher end of medium good. Yeah, I just I, I would give that a medium good. I wouldn't really say higher end. Okay. Yeah, that's, well, that's, medium that's good a, is like really stretched out now. Yeah. Can you guys uh, see my cursor? Nice, or no. Oh man, how about a nice bump for my GTI buddies? I'm Elise. Ah, you ready? You gotta move Elise up. That was the GTI. Yeah. Yeah. There I, you go. Uh, my mem we, my we, memory's pretty good bribed. for for uh, the for last bribes? little bit. Yeah, for bribes. <laughs> <laughs> it's bad for everything else. It's good for bribes. Okay. We we moved you up, Elise. Thank you. Thanks for watching our <laughs> channel. Uh, okay. <laughs> well, oh, wait a second. Adam just said it's just the trim. LS is a Miata trim. Okay, Yuri, move that Miata. No, down. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Uh, let's go move, right move here. Yeah, yeah, th right there, right there. That's good. Thank you for correcting our almost horrible mistake. Thank you guys. Okay. Uh, Yuri has a 2017 Miata RF Club. Uh, it's a club, so that's cooler than the other RF, but I would put it like next to that RF because there's probably no room. Okay. Oh, no. I pushed the wrong button again. Yes, you did. All right. We're back. <laughs> oh, I lost it. Uh-oh. Where'd it go? Control T. There it is. <laughs> well, this, this, this is the fun of doing all this stuff live. Uh, okay. There's no room. I'm putting it down here. Ethan got this Miata for $800. He's 16 years old. He's fixed it up, fixed it up and he's put a ton of miles on it. Okay. Um, I mean, that's, that's pretty cool. He got it for 800 bucks. Like he got it for 800 that, bucks and, and he fixed it up and he learned how to do old car stuff on it. That, that's probably cooler than the other Miatas just because of the story behind it. Yeah. Not um, that we want every single person's story because we can't handle that, yeah. but that, that's cool. Yeah. Stories are cut as of this video. That was only yeah. that was only the first person with a story. Okay, <laughs> uh, Alex has a 2018 BMW 440i M Performance. That is super clean. He's got like a lip kit around it. That I looks really like really that. badass. Yeah, I really like that. Uh, um, let's put that right at the borderline of so yeah, good. Yeah. It's not an M car. Exactly. I mean, if you start messing with BMW, it pretty much has to be an M. Okay. Yeah, yo, a lot of people in the comments also like that car. So good job with the mods you did. Yeah. You killed it. Alex has a 93, and he wrote Toyota Forerunner. He wanted me to say Toyota. I like those. Um, it looks like it's it might be lifted. Um, I like it a lot. I, I don't know if it's so good. I would put that at medium good. Okay, where's the other off -road? If it was a wheeling picture, then I probably would have been swayed. Uh, I, like I don't think he sent a wheeling photo for that. Okay. Okay, I'm going to add that at the uh, higher end of medium good. Okay. Yo, a lot of people really like that BMW. Ali, so. okay, let's let's move that BMW up a bit. Yeah, we're gonna move it up based on the comments, guys. This is this is this is a whole uh, is a, system. Yeah, okay, Ali has a 15 BMW 535i. Um, I would give that a medium good, like on the lower oh, end. I pushed the wrong button again. I keep pushing F instead of F4. Okay, medium good. Press F to pay respects. Next, we have Andrew. Okay, this is a good one. You ready? Andrew has an 05 Legacy Wagon with a five-speed. He also sent a photo of him and his buddy dressed up as Ghostbusters. <laughs> All right. Well, give that a – I mean, it's already a wagon. It's a turbo. It's a – yeah, yeah. Give, give it a so good. Let's That's go. Funny. Let's go. Yeah, yeah. It's the little things. The little things that add up. It is. It is. Okay. Uh, hello from oh, – You do yours. You do yours. I'll wait a minute. Uh, hello from Edmonton. What is your guys' opinion of the 2018 Chevrolet Volt? Keep up the great work on the show. Okay, so I think the Volt is pretty cool because you can plug it in and drive it like a normal car. And the used values are actually already pretty cheap. So if you're looking at a 2018, it's probably already pretty cheap. So that's a pretty cool car. 
Okay, so we have a 1990 Golf GTI with a VR6 swap. And this guy was at the Oblivion car show with me. Um, uh, yeah, remember that? That looks like ooh, that looks like Ontario Place, and I see a fox body next to it. Yeah, that is um, that is very so good. To be that, honest, that is if so I good. saw that, I, I'd be like, I yes. would put that in so good. And the fact that he told you it's a VR6, like, yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm I'm gonna put that in so good. Okay. So, hey, submitted a car through Instagram. Uh, it'll be on the next, next one, video. Man, you just did that right and now. just uh, send me a text and remind me that you've bribed me. <laughs> send a <laughs> yeah. screenshot of your bribe so I know it's a real bribe. Okay. Yeah. Uh, 19 Ooh. Veloster N, and he had it wrapped in Kitchener. Hmm. Um, I mean, don't it, they come in that color? That's what I thought too. I don't know, but I feel like he wrote it was wrapped. Anyways, yeah, I thought it was the other Veloster. The other Veloster, I think, got a got a little bit of a bribe though. Yeah. So where's the other one? Um, okay, guys, you can press stop pressing F now, please. The the respects are they've been paid. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay, this will go here. Next, we That's have uh, Antoine with a 2007 Honda Civic. You know what? If I've ever seen a good car, this is the goodest car I've ever seen. I would put that to the left side of good. That is not that there's anything wrong with it. No, no, but no. There's nothing exciting. About my it. my father-in-law has one. It got into an accident, and uh, he bought another one exactly the same color. Um, but it's like, why wouldn't you get that if you just need a commuter car? You know what I mean? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Andrew has a 1994 Miata M edition, and this guy was the first guy to submit a car. Okay, uh, it's got a roll bar. He's obviously tracking it. Put it slightly to the right of the rest of the Miatas if you can. I, yeah, I also agree. Because right he's there. got pop-up headlights and everything, so yeah. Okay, and this is uh, Fatty has a 13 Focus ST. You know I love my Focus STs. Yeah, that that's a solid medium good. Mm-hmm. That is Pretty like solid that, that's right below Veloster's, I think. Like I would probably Veloster take that. Ends? Yeah, Focus STs. I would put that to the left of Veloster. No, no, yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Okay. Uh, right. Uh, sorry, I gotta scroll up. Uh, Arun has a 2008 Volkswagen R32. Okay. Uh, love the wheels. I believe they are BBSs. Three, three door. Uh, yeah, it's an R32, which is the six cylinder, I believe, of this generation. That I'm gonna I'm gonna give that a so good. It's very cool. Yeah, that's so good. And I think those came in manual as well. Okay, I mean, I, I think, SR has a 2014 is, Sox Madass 125. What is this? I don't know. It looks like a cool bike though. I. <laughs> Put that where you want it. Okay. I, I got no opinion cool, on that. Cool, cool bike. I like it. I don't know anything about bikes. Okay. We, I fell off a bike once we and have, I jumped it once. We have a 2007 Acura CSX Type S. Should Ooh. I put that next to the Civic or just to the right of it? I think to the right of it. It is that exact Civic, isn't it? It, it is, but it, like better. Didn't Ben get one? Yeah. The Type S is basically like the uh, SI kind of thing. Okay, uh, Frank has a 2012 Infiniti G37X. I'm going mm. to put that right next to the I, other G37. Yes, uh, quick story. So I drove one of those when I actually was debating buying one, and I was so bored. Oh, take a I, shot. Uh, Jacob Jacob was talking, thinking about buying a car. Dude, I actually went to the dealership to drive one, and that's how close I was. And I drove it. I'm like, this, I just don't like it. This is not good. Okay, let me just move. That's actually the car that I drove before I ended up buying my IS350, so I liked my IS350 much more than that. Interesting. All right, uh, the next car on the list is, how many cars do we have left? We have probably, now we got like probably a quarter of the cars and the whole is done. Oh, okay. This is probably going to top the list for a lot of people. I'm going to make some room. Uh, I'll make some room in advance. Okay. You guys ready? Take a breather. There's a, there's a lot of people pressing F right now. Did the stream die? Um, no, it looks like it's still going for me, so I think people are just pressing F. Oh, I think F because you took a shot because um, you're dead because you oh. took a shot because you talked about buying a car. I see. Hold on, let me just drop. Uh, show that ST some love. Oh, man. Which ST? Oh, the Focus ST. Yuri, we, we got bribed. 
I'll take one it. Of the, one of those Focus STs, the latest ones, needs to be moved up. Uh, oh, the white one. No, the white, white one. one. That was the only one. Uh, okay. It's at the bottom. Oh, I got to make it a little uh, bigger. Next question. Uh, thanks for sharing my 2013 white Focus ST. Uh-oh. Okay, so I think RPD paid... He, I think we got a double bribe Double right bribe. Oh, man. <laughs> Borla exhaust, air intake, cob tuner, mud, mud flaps, custom spoiler, wing carbon fiber, more mod to come. Okay. Yeah, that's cool. Okay, uh, this one. Franny submitted that from Heidi... Uh, from... Oh, yeah, Heidi and Franny's garage. Yes, it is a 1958 Porsche 356A T2 Cabriolet. <laughs> and I believe the story was that it was purchased from uh, one of the family members of the Boeing company. I mean, look how clean that is. That is like, everything. that is like, crazy. That's, that's and so they're, they're always working yeah. on these cars. Like, I'm not into yeah. classics as much as I should be, but I believe that that's probably as good as like a Lambo. You know what I mean? I would put that in the same category. To people, to people who understand how to... good it is, it's probably exactly. that good. Yeah. And we saw a bunch of this cool stuff at the Porsche Museum. So yeah, I, I really that, like that. That's so good. Ah, I pushed the wrong uh, button again. Cheers for the uh, cheers for the so good on my Mark V R2 boys. Just realized that I hit 24 months on Patreon too, so let's celebrate with a quick bribe. Oh, dude, he bribed us. Which He's a subscriber. R32? Thirty-two, yeah. Uh, let me find that. You got a ruin. I think we already put it in so good, but we got to uh, we got to make that a little bigger. Yeah, that's the one. Yeah, I'm running out uh, of uh, Art, I'm running out of space. Arjun, guys. thank you for that. Uh, okay. Yeah. Next. Oh, we got a couple uh, Heidi and Franny fans in the chat. That's good. Okay. Next. Yeah, yeah. Actually, I actually want to go there and drive all their cars. Also, so congratulations on uh, 24 months as being a Patreon too. So thank you. Okay. Uh, you ready for this next one? Yep. Jean Marco has a 1979 Fiat 124 Spider. Is that so good? I think it is. That's really cool. I know. It's just like, it's not as cool as that other Porsche from Heidi and Franny. I I'm going to give that a little left to so good. I would say it's that's really equivalent nice, to the RX-7. Yes. Yes, exactly. Uh, which is located somewhere here. Let me move this Type R over. There. Okay. Uh, now, okay. You guys have been waiting for it. We got the Ford Flex from Gordon. <laughs> Gordon, is, uh, he's been doing some cool fan art. He's been racing with us on GT Sport. This is his yeah. uh, Ford Flex. Not his, but, you know, it's the Ford Flex. Yeah. I mean... We've, uh... It's We've definitely been playing with Gordon on PS4 as well. It's definitely a good car. I, I would give it a good. I'm gonna give it slightly above. But he also bribed us earlier, asking for when this is gonna come up. So you gotta put it in medium, and you gotta give him a bigger thumbnail. Okay, okay, Gordon, this one's for you. Yeah, there you go, Gordon. Also, keep up the good racing on Gran Turismo Sport. Okay, next, you're gonna like this one, Jacob. Yeah. Jeremy has a 2002 S2000. With RPF ones and a red interior, yo. By the way, if you're selling that, hit me up. Oh, take a shot. Yeah, it was good. Take a shot, guys. F. Oh man, that's so clean. That's, I personally think, especially the way it's sitting, uh, that's cooler than the Miatas. Yeah, but I haven't driven one. Well, like, what's his name? Just got a Miata, and just talking oh about God. comparing it to his S2K. Uh, Jason. Hang on. Wait, what? You're comparing this to a Miata, right? Yes. And then who just bought? A Miata to replace his yeah. S2K. Yeah, but explain. the way this is sitting, I know, I know. Okay, uh, hang on, we, we got a couple bribes now. Uh, this is my bribe, so my car appears next video. I just sent it to Yuri. Uh, my IG is underscore twenty one underscore underscore twenty nine underscore. Your videos are great, and I hope you reach one million soon. Yo, message Yo, me and tell me screenshot. Message me and that. tell me you bribed me. I'm gonna spend all of tomorrow is just going to be doing this. Okay, Yuri, um, Heidi and Franny's garage, they just bribed us. You're going to have to leave it where it is and make it larger. Okay. I can't believe you bribed us for that. You are, you're already in so good, Heidi. Yeah, okay. So, Heidi, let's move. Um, uh, hold on. No, I'm, I'm trying to, I'm trying to go strategically. For it. Go chat. I forgot to get my G70 in. So, you, uh, so can you give that white stinger the so good love it deserves? It was, I believe that stinger was silver, um, but you did bribe us. No, it was, so yeah, okay. Where's that stinger? I Guys, think... I'm, I'm going to run out of space. 
I know. Please stop bribing me. I cannot take any more bribes. Okay, where's that stinger? Uh, stinger, okay. Uh, oh, man. Yo, we just got a lot of bribes, Yuri. I hope you're ready to adjust them. Bro, they don't call me Yuri the Photoshop Terrigen for nothing. <laughs> You're the bribe, Terrigen. You're the. I wish. I, I would never take a bribe in real life. I'm too much of a wuss. Okay, what's the next bribe? <laughs> uh, the next one. <laughs> the next one is um, that's Bianca, my spider. Come drive in Ottawa. So that was the Fiat. And uh, Jean Marco was a spider. Very fitting name. Wait, John John Marco spider us. gets a. Yes. Uh, yes. Where is that? He seems to want us to drive it as well in Ottawa. Not that we could travel right now. No. Because we've got to stay home. Okay. I'm going to move this bribe up. Oh, dude. Uh, that's not even my flex, but I want to bribe for it. <laughs> Wait, what? Okay, so Gordon, Gordon's flex just got double bribed. Wow. Not even by Gordon, by someone else. Wow. Double bribe. Guys, we're going to run out of bribing zones. Yeah. Um... Oh, wow. Okay, so we just got triple bribed, Yuri. Is this the flex? <laughs> so Gordon just said the family wagon with 355 horsepower EcoBoost. The Ford Flex just got bribed again. Oh, man. By Gordon. Super uh, bad. Bribe. Oh, boy. Uh, submitted my 93 Corolla wagon. What do you all think? Fairly regular car, but never seen uh, another one. So kind of rare, but only got 50K miles on it. It's not Corolla in this one. Wagon. There's no Corolla wagon no. in this one, but... Just let me know, and I'll make sure to... S send a screenshot of that bribe to Yuri's account. Uh, one more. Hi, here's another bribe. What time is your next video? Uh, the next video... We have a video for Friday. Yeah, it won't be a live video, but we actually do have a video for Friday. It's a little bit shorter, a little bit different, but we scrounge through all of our existing footage and put something together that's actually really cool. So Friday at 8 a.m. Eastern time. It's going to be an, actual, an actually cool video. Okay, you ready? Can I get yeah. back to it? Go for it, Yuri. Uh, Grant with a 2014 Veloster Turbo. I'm going uh, to put that in the medium good section, I think. But the mods are tasteful. Yeah. The, the mods are tasteful. It looks like he deleted his reflector, too, because uh, I don't like yellow or orange reflectors, so that's, that's pretty clean. Okay. Oh, thank God. I can put oh, that in medium dude. good. Dude. More more bribes? Oh, uh, yeah, for the flex. A bribe for the flex. Also, hope my S60R appears in the next video. Wow. Dude, dude this flex is just going to be the whole chip. Man, you guys are really flexing us with this with this flex. Yeah. Wow, your flex keeps getting bigger. I don't know what to tell you guys. I'm, this is gonna be the biggest car. We have rules. Here. Okay, Gunner has a '74 Super Beetle, which I think we could put next to the other Beetle. I really like the way it looks. I agree. We've driven yeah, one, so and uh, it died on us. But then we drove another one that didn't yeah. die on us. Um, that is true. That was a fun story. Okay, and then we have another guy named Gunner who has a 2011 Nissan GTR. Okay, GTR. Uh, that was that's sure that's one of the coolest cars ever, man. It, it is, but I'm just not sure if I'm a fan of that wheel color. But I like the wheels. Yeah, but it but matches anyways. the wing. I'm gonna give that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so good. That, oh, I, no, I think I pushed the wrong so button again. Yeah, that's a so good. F four. Where'd it go? I lost. There it is. You know, people are still asking how to submit. Can you just like show them the instructions on the left side of the screen? Okay. If you, if you want, okay, guys, guys, here's how it is. If you want to know how to submit a video, go to Yuri Tereshin on Instagram, which is down here at the bottom left. Uh, and then I need you guys to write, don't even write like the cool the car thing. Just write your name, the year, the model, and the trim. And then send a photo of you and your car and of just the car that you want. Hopefully, um, landscape and mode. Your first name. Yeah, and your first name. That was the first thing I said. Name, um, yes. name, year, model, trim. Please. Oh, we'll do this. We'll do this nonstop. But like, it takes. Oh. Oh God. Keep the flex going. Yeah. I saw that. We, we, yeah, we got another one for the flex, dude. This flex is. It's just gonna take over. Oh no. Is it behind you? You gotta now? save room. I, I feel like people are going to continue. Yeah, it is behind me now. Okay. I feel like people are going to continue uh, hyping this thing up. Okay, what if the flex just stays behind you? Wait, am I blocking some cars right now? Oh, I'm totally blocking cars so. right now. John Marco's, uh -oh. I think. Hey, Jacob. What's up? Uh oh. Why are we so close now? Uh, transform. Uh oh. Flip horizontal. Maybe I'll just live above the Ford Flex. Yeah, you could live there. That's still uh, six feet apart. I'm going to make myself smaller. 
<laughs> Love green screen. Okay, uh, Han has a 2007 CRV that is very, very overland. It is overland AF. That's definitely um, into medium good. It is. It is into medium good. You got a light bar. Yeah. Okay, next on the list, Jeff has a Nissan Pao with a five speed. I don't know what this is. He said, he said 1990, which is uh, not correct, I don't think. I don't really know what's going on here, but I like it as much as I like Beatles. I've seen the stuff on the uh, Nissan Figaro from uh, Mighty Car Mods, so I don't know. I think that's pretty cool. Beatles own. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, Ivan has a 2020 Skoda Superb Hybrid or Super B. I don't know, but he bribed Super. us earlier. So, um, oh, he did. I mean, I can't really put it – into so I good, would put it into good, but it's gonna, it's definitely gonna be a bigger thumbnail. It's gonna be a bigger thumbnail in good. Uh, waiting for the sport turismo to show up. Oh, wow, David apparently has a sport turismo. Okay, that um, didn't make the cut. I'm sorry. Uh, okay, David, screenshot that bribe and send it to Yuri for the future video. You guys are really making my life difficult. With all oh, yeah, because now you're gonna have to memorize these, you have to uh, memorize bribes. Yeah, uh, bribe someone Mercedes C55 AMG makes the next video. Oh, wow. Yo, okay, just save your bribes for the next video. That's what I'm saying, yeah, so, yeah. So if, if your car isn't in this video, do not send your bribes yet yeah. because it's going to be okay. really hard to keep track of that. Go for it. Hassan has a 16 Forester, and this is HK997 from Gran Turismo Racing. Mm, okay, so he plays with us, so that's cool. Bonus points for that. Car is not cool GT's at car. all. No, it's not. So let's um, give him a, the. Uh, let's give him a good. A good. Let's give him like a, a little bit of a, a, little bit of a bonus, for racing with us. Yeah. I dig it. Okay, Jack has a '93 Volvo 245 GL with 430,000 kilometers. That is between medium good and so good. Maybe high medium good. I I would give that a, a low so good. Okay. Uh, yeah. where can I? I don't. <laughs> There, I can fit it in underneath this uh, Viper yeah, Green G, uh, Golf that R. Works. Okay, Jack has a 2011 GTI 2.5. Um, definitely yeah, good. You mean a GLI? GLI? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, not even a GLI, yeah. just a Jetta. Sorry. Oh, it's just, just wait, a Jetta. Did we get Did we get previously bribed for this? Oh man. If we got um, previously bribed, let us know. I don't know, but I'm give I'm gonna give that a, a good, just just a good. Good. Okay. If it was a GLI, it would have been a little bit higher. Yeah, I'm going to remove this how to post because we're going to need this. Yes, we are. Uh, also, yeah, people will be able to figure it out later. Yeah, or we'll get a million comments about it. Is this the our most successful live stream ever? Probably because of the green. Okay, uh, I think so. Jacob, spelled J-A-C-O-B, has a 2009 Crown Vic. He submitted another car, but I figured this one was a little more fun. Uh, that's cool, as long as you're not the guy with the hair dryer out though um because that looks he's got a basket on top i know i know well i guess that kind of looks uh, like lights that's actually hilarious it, it, not that's bad. exactly it okay let's give that a a medium good solid medium good uh, uh gray 2013 range rover sport hfc um okay so i uh i owned a tw 2007 for like one day did you buy it, it was super cool i did buy oh, it oh shot uh it was uh super cool um I'm just gonna give you a, a pretty cool. Okay, one. James has a just Fiat 124 Spider Abarte. Okay, let me get the super chats after. I'm gonna hit this. Um, I'm gonna hit this with the with the next with the Miatas. Yeah. Maybe a little. But do you think it's it's cooler than? Do you think it's cooler? I think it's cooler because it's it's so good. I because personally don't. Then an RF. I'm gonna put it to the right of the RF so I can find a spot. Okay. Uh, just upload mini club and of course need to give some love to the bloated cousin Flex. Oh my God. Yuri, the flex is getting larger. Oh, no. <laughs> People keep bribing us about the flex. Uh-oh. Uh, the CRV's lights are hellas. The bar is actually for a WRX for Jerry Rigs to fit. Okay, so you got to find that uh, CRV that I believe we put into medium good. Man, you guys, you guys, my life, I thought this was supposed to be <laughs> chill. It's those bribes. Uh, yeah. Where is the CRV? Uh... It had the hellas. Or I had the fog, yeah, the fog lights up front. Oh, I think God. we put into into medium good. I'm trying to find it. Uh, uh oh. We're we're almost done, guys. I swear. Like, there's like, 
Maybe, oh, here it is. Maybe there's like 15 more cars. Did you enlarge the flex already? Oh, yeah. All right. This guy right here. Okay. Uh, someone, someone just paid to say, please check my DM, Yuri. Here's a quick bribe. <laughs> Save, save your future bribes for the future my, video. We will put your cars in the video, but we won't know about the bribes until the video. I think I gotta hire someone to just go through my Instagram messages Instagram. now. Okay, yeah. ready? Well, I was getting them too, and okay. I was like, I'm not. Jamie has an 89 Saab 900 that I think he fixed up because it was all beaten up. That's yeah, that's cool. Gonna... Remember uh, Victor had one? Yeah, I do remember that. That was actually like my first turbo experience. So well, he had a car before all of us, remember? He did. Uh, I would give that uh, a low so good. Mm -hmm. Oh, I pushed the wrong button again. I got to just disable because I keep pushing F. Uh, low so good. <laughs> oh, uh, someone said Jetta was a bribe five cylinder manual. Uh oh. Can uh -oh. we find that? Um, yep. I think we placed it into good. Wait, is this one? Yeah, I, I think so. That's the one. Or was it? Yeah, yeah, that's good. That's These good. came in five cylinders? Uh, yeah, they did. Dang. Just like the Golfs. Dang. All right, guys. I hope you like... Like, I feel like I, I did the right amount of sizing for this. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, let's go to the... Uh, Jonas has a Miata GT. So this is the first Miata, new Miata convertible, which has to be better. I mean, it's better than an RF. I'm not going to lie. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. Okay. So uh, let me just move 9 million cars so I can throw him. Where's the other Miatas? Uh, guys, this is, this is the most difficult. Uh, I pushed the wrong button again. This is the most difficult uh -oh. thing I've ever had to do. Uh, <laughs> where is That's it? fun doing this live, though, so everyone can struggle through this like us. Mm, okay, right here. There. Yeah, yeah. Yes, I'm satisfied with the placement okay. of the image. Joel, ha you, Joel has a 99 Camaro Z28, and he also sent me a photo of him doing a nasty burnout. So, I so, mean... Sorry, your, your audio is cutting out. Is that a V8? That is a Z28, so yes. And he sent okay. me a photo of him doing a nasty burnout as well. Then he's on the closer side of so good. Yeah, must be nice to... Uh... I really don't like that generation, but... I don't either, but, I mean, a cool car is a cool yeah. car. Yeah. There, I fit it in. How many do I have left? Let me just count real quick. Jacob, do you have a minute to answer some questions? I'll just answer some regular questions. Oh, dude, I Let's got like see. oh people. I got like like twenty more. I think I'm gonna get rid of the top row of so good to medium good, or maybe I'll lower that. Well, maybe we should save some of them for next time. No, Priority no, dude, hours. we have like five hundred more. Okay. Oh boy. Okay, we'll we'll finish this. Like we said, we would. Let me just. I'm getting rid of this top part. If you've been here long enough. You know what's going on. Let me just add yeah, you some. You gotta keep that. <clears throat> Nobody's gonna know where anything is. Okay, okay. Uh, you can't get rid of that stuff. Just, I should make it smaller. Where we send in our cars. Uh, details to send cars are yeah, like here. another hour yes, or 45 I, minutes. I think. When is the next live stream like this? Uh, probably next week, to be honest, because this is pretty fun. I'm sorry, babe. My, the last year's going a lot longer than I thought it'd go. Well, it's two hours. I think we expected two hours, so we should probably just cut it off soon. Yeah, okay. I, we, okay, uh, let's, let's rip through these cars quick then, okay? Everyone stop sending super chats. But we could just save them for next time. Okay. It's fine. Uh, Jaren, 2009 Golf R. That's an easy just, one. Just put that with the other Golf Rs. Uh, you got you to gotta minimize this stuff next time so that it's not all the same car. Okay, Golf R. Uh, well, let's put that. Oh, we got a quick bribe again, guys. DMG Yuri, thanks. Okay, save your future bribes for the upcoming Jacob. video when your car is going to be in it. 09 Audi S5. That is so good. I'm just going to go ahead and assume it's a manual because uh, uh, those came with V8s in that generation, okay, I believe. Okay, next. Uh, Colton has a 2010 Volkswagen Golf 5-cylinder. Good. Uh, where did that go? That's going up to good. Yeah. And then uh, a 2000, Lewis, Lewis has a 2016 Arctic Cat ZR 4000 RR. That's a lot of numbers and R's. Any, anything, anytime you can increase the number of cool. So I would put that into so good. Yeah, we need to have a, a write on section. Yeah, yeah. Uh, okay, Luke has an S63 coupe. I mean, that's, uh, that's so, so good. good. That's, that's really so cool. good. 
Yeah. Uh, next, Mark has a 2019 Veloster and and in the photo, there's a, a air, low flying airplane doing aerobatics in the background. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Uh, I mean, I'm put a, it with the other I'm throw Veloster. Velosters. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Matusen has an 11 2011 BMW 335D. Let's put that medium yeah. good. Sorry, your audio cut out. I couldn't hear you. Uh, Matusen, I don't know how to say that. Sorry, it has a 2011 BMW 335D. Oh, it's a diesel. 335 is cool, though. Medium yeah, good. Place it, place it where you placed it. Uh-oh. I think you pressed something. Again. Oh, yeah. It's it's old habits die hard. <laughs> uh, Mike has a 14, 2014 XXX 360 CI Sprint car. I think he said 700 horsepower, and he's won one race. Uh, He's going the farthest right possible. <laughs> yeah, that's really awesome. Wow. Yeah. We, we, we're going to rewind that real quick. And we'll That's get a good amazing. look at that. Isn't that cool? Yeah. Did you guys see this? Holy. Okay. Um, if I suck GT Sport, am I also? I am also legally blind. <laughs> All right. Oh, you're explaining why you suck. Well, there you go. Legally blind. Okay. Uh, Matt has an 04 Mini convertible. I feel like we got a bribe for this, didn't we? I don't remember if we got a um, convertible bribe. Anyways, that's definitely medium I don't good. Recall. Yeah. Yeah. Uh oh. What's that text there? <laughs> there. Uh, okay. And then we have. Here, I guess I can get rid of our ranking system faces in the background. Then we have a. Oh! Okay. LP got an 18, a 2018 Subaru WRX off our recommendation. And look at like the wrap job on it. Yeah, I know, I know. Uh, put them next to the other WRX, but to the right if you can. I see it in the middle. Of yeah, yeah, the I know, yeah. Then, okay. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Matt has a 2010 Mitsubishi Evo X. Is X? Is it Evo 10? Is that what it's actually called? Yes. <laughs> okay. Yes. Evo 10. That's, uh, that's nice wheels on it. Nice, nice stance. I like that car a lot. I would give that a so good. Hitting them with the so good. Uh, then yeah. we have LJ has a 15 BMW M3 in blue. I mean, so good. That's a so good. Yeah, for sure. And then Matt has a 2002 Mazda Protégé 5. And he didn't send proof because he said, who would lie about this? <laughs> um, I mean, he's right. He's good. Yeah, it's that, definitely good. Exactly okay. Right. That's good. This is Jeff. Jeff Z28 in GT Sport has an 07 Corvette. I mean, he's getting a... Isn't it, uh, isn't it supercharged or something too? Or a cam. It's cammed. Oh, it's cam. Uh, anyways, that's, that's so good. So good. Jeff, you're great at racing and I'm enjoying racing against you. Uh, Jacob has an 86 Dodge Ram W150. I would give that a medium good. I mean, it looks really cool. Solid medium good. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Josh has a 92 Miata, and it's got the cool sleepy headlights. So, I mean, that's a slightly better than the other Miatas, I think. I, I agree. Uh, he's got cool wheels on it, too. Okay. So, let me hit that right up there in the so yeah. good territory. That's fair. Jesse... With the 99 Mustang GT, we all know Jesse. Oh, yes. Uh, I believe it is straight pipes, if I recall. Uh, give him a so good. I'm going to give him a so good. He's one of the earliest straight pipers. He is, yeah. Uh, Justin is uh, restoring in 86994. Um, so good. Wait, what are these noises, Yuri? Um, delivery food. We've been going way too long. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing I can do about it. You guys are just gonna have to accept it. Okay. I just hear a lot of stuff. In the Carl, Carl bought a 19 Kia Stinger off our recommendation. Jacob. Oh, that dude, that's so good because that's the the ghost gray color. And that this is supposed to get a bump from the G70 guy. Yeah, that, that's a so good. Okay, so good. Oh, uh, Jeff, uh, cammed and supercharged daily, 650 at the wheels. Yes, Jeff. Okay, guys, honestly, uh, stop bribing. Hey, I Jeff, can't. I have no more room for bribes. Make, make Jeff's car bigger if you can. Okay. Okay, this this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that that works. Uh, okay, where's Jeff's car? Jeff's car is now bigger, and then let's move this cool race car up here. Jacob, uh, I think we should save our top five cars for maybe a video down the line because we <laughs> it's running late. Okay. Um, yes. We have I think ten more cars. Well. It's like 15. Okay. Uh, Joey has a 2015 Fit. That is uh, 
just a normal car? Uh, yes. Uh, also, Yuri, we've been bribed to put someone cars, someone's car down. Oh, uh, uh, Jesse, Jesse doesn't need that ego boost. Drop him down to good. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody drop Jesse's car down. Jesse, you got to talk to your boy Alec. Keep him in check. <laughs> he just got moved over. Yeah. Uh, Colton, would it improve the ranking if I told you my Golf five cylinder with one straight pipe has a cap back now? I don't know. I mean, you did bribe us, so yes. I think it's um, this one, right? I, I don't know. There's been a couple. I'm, I'm going to assume golf, this. I think. Okay, yeah. we're almost if done. If that's not yours, then sorry, but it is. it, it just got bumped. Okay, uh, John has a 20, 2010 BMW 550i. Uh, let's just put that with the other one that's similar. Yeah, I would put that into, yeah, medium good. I lost it. There it is. Okay, uh, Jordan has a 2019 Audi e-tron. That's definitely medium good. Yeah. Nothing special. I mean, we haven't but even driven it. It's... I would put that into good. Like, it's not an exciting car. There's nothing wrong with it's it. Really good. Okay, Jorge has a 2017 Forerunner SR5, and he's using it to tow stuff. But it's not as cool as that other uh, TRD Pro. I would put that into medium it good. It kind of looks like a TRD Pro. Look at the front end. No, I know, because the SR5 is pretty legit, too. Okay. I, I would put them to medium good. Medium good. We're trying our best, guys. I'm so sorry. Okay, Call has a 19 Colorado ZR2. I think it was called Midnight Edition. So good. Okay. I believe I'm reversed. Well, so. that's the only car we've been allowed to jump, so. Okay, Luke has a 2018 Jeep Wrangler Sport. Let's add that to uh, between medium good and so good, I think. Yeah, I think so. And then... Uh, John has a 19 Ranger. Let's add that with that uh, Australian Ranger SUV. Yes, into good. Into good. Uh, yeah. Matt has a 2018 Kia Sportage. I think he said it's a dad mobile. So it's definitely good. Uh, it's definitely good. And I think we're on our last 10 for real now. Matt okay. has a Sentra SR Turbo Manual. Uh, I would still put that into good. Okay, good. Uh, oh, okay. I'm going to have to clear up some room on the right real quick. Uh, sorry. Uh, Michael has a Boxster, a 911, and a Miata. Okay, a triple car submission, and he's got a Boxster now. Um, yeah, I mean, that's a pretty epic combo. I would go to so good on that. Yeah. Uh, that's and I think his PlayStation should be in soon, so he should be ready to be playing GT Sport with us. So I'll put him next. I'll put him next to Jeff, in the so good. Yeah. Oh yeah. God, wrong button. Uh -oh. I'm gonna disable that button. Yo, y'all are so awesome. Thank you for even showing my sled. Yo, that's a sick looking sled. Thank you, Lewis. Oh man, we're gonna make it bigger. Yo, does anyone else have a better combo than those three cars? or just submit it uh, yeah. all three cars in one picture though okay picture. uh mateo has a 93 bmw Ooh. m3 <laughs> uh, is that a euro spec anyways I, I like that that's going in so good with a name like mateo yeah okay uh and then m another mateo from italy drives a mazda cx30 but it's a manual which i don't know if we get uh, i would still put that into good yeah and that's there's only room for good now okay <laughs> matthew has a 18 Fiat 124 Abarte. So let's well, add that with the other one. Uh, well, I don't know where that is. I feel like that was like in the so good area. There, I found a no, spot you, for you it. You cannot submit your dad's shop. He's got to be your cars. You know, tell your dad to get Instagram and submit it. Exactly. Maddie with an totally. orange uh, 2015 Fiesta ST. Is that the same color as yours? Uh, yes, it is. Molten orange. Let's give that uh, a, uh, that's a so, so good. good next to the sled. Yeah. Uh, sorry if I'm overlapping your photos. I'm trying my best not to. Micah has a 1979 Enstrom 280C. To be honest, probably the best helicopter ever. Micah actually submitted his helicopter. <laughs> yeah, no, he totally did. Okay. Well, he, he, he gets a so good so for good. that. Okay, so good. And then we've got uh, Miguel with an 09 GTI, but it's stage one. Ooh. Uh, I guess... Around the GTIs, so it is stage one. Okay, let's call it medium good. And then we have we have three more. Miles with a 2020 Audi Q8. Mm. That car was really nice. Remember how much we liked it? Yeah, it was really like, It's good. not exciting, uh, but it's... Exactly, like, I would give that a medium good. Medium good slash so good. Okay, 
Uh, yeah. Actually, no, I'll make some room for this next one. Uh, no, no. Okay. Mohammed sent this, and I think it's a – you said it's 2019, but I don't know what it is. I think it's it a It looks Kia like Forte. a Forte, Forte 5 to me or a Forte. But you know how, um, like, even, different countries have, like, yeah, weird models, so I'm, I'm going to give that a good. Yeah, that's a, that's a good. All right, and we're on our last one, everybody. Uh, Nick it. has an 03 Z06 Corvette, which I think is obviously a so good. Yeah, that's a so good. That's a C5. C5 Z06, best value. Okay, I think we're done. We're done. How do we do? I, I, I'm I'm happy with this ranking and the way that we ranked cars. You? Yeah, I'm uh, very happy. I think this worked out well. I think we got to limit it to 200 cars. And yes. I, if, if it wasn't for that Ford Flex just, you know, taking up so much real estate. Well, you guys kept bribing us and obviously monies. <laughs> oh, okay. My face goes here then. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That makes sense. All right. Uh, let me just flip it so I'm facing you, Jacob. Uh, Uh-oh. Flip we got uh, Oh. Here, we already got bribed. Uh, that would be my molten orange fist. It has orange on orange, and it's been to BC twice now. So thank you for showing it. Affordable dream car. All road right, trip. I'm gonna I'm gonna increase the Thanks. size, but just let just so you know, it's a so good. Yes, it is. Okay. We uh, just moved it, but it's still so good. And uh, molten orange is the same color as Raptor. Let me just. Oh, I'm, thanks for all the love for the Flex Eco Boost, Yuri. Uh, that's the the Flex just got bigger. Oh man. This is the most popular. I mean, that's probably cooler than a Murcielago or anything. You know what I mean? Yeah. Or as they would say, Murcielago. Did you enlarge the flex yet? Yeah, no, I did. I got to just move it because the, the, no, I enlarged, oh, okay. no, I enlarged it for the flex. I enlarged the Fiesta, but then the flex okay, got the bigger. Flex. Yeah, the flex needs to get bigger. Yeah, okay. Okay, this is, okay. <laughs> this is the official ranking. The only thing that can get bigger from now on is the flex because we have to go. Like, I literally have dinner. I need to get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, we didn't know it would take this long. Uh, thank you all for watching. Yeah, thank you guys. This has been super We're gonna, fun. I'm going to save this and hopefully post it somewhere. Yeah. Um, I, I think this is the new official cool wall. I think we killed it. We did better than everyone else. And we did not, you know, it's just positive things about everyone's car. We're spreading positivity yeah. right now. Exactly. It's, it's not exactly a ripoff of the cool wall, but it's good and so good. Because that's all we say. It's as good of a <laughs> ripoff as we could have had. Oh, I didn't want to. Yeah. I can't even put my face anywhere because I'm covering everything. Everyone likes the cool wall from Top Gear, so I mean, this is kind of similar. It's pretty much almost kind of the same. But they also had a very different ranking system. Yeah. Uh, I'm buying a black two door Silverado SS. Is that cool? Yes. Uh, I've sent my combo to Yuri. Don't miss, guys. Okay. Don't keep bribing us now. We're, we're done. This is it. Just follow this link. I'm going to post it one last time. Go to this link. Read every single instruction on that link thank you guys do for not, watching yeah do not miss anything on that can't link. believe you guys picked the ford flex over everything else yeah <laughs> well i think the ford flex is officially the winner of this round I, you guys kept bribing us on that so okay but yo jacob gordon one last yeah. last second okay um favorites uh this one yeah that's pretty sick uh, i don't know even know what i can overlap the um Murcia lago yeah the uh I would say the GTR Pro as well. Okay, let me just move this up. Uh, I can't. It, it takes it takes a while to do all this stuff. You know what? Okay, you guys know which ones we picked. <laughs> yeah, that one. That one. Uh, what else we got? The Huracan with the twin turbos. The M3 is yeah, really cool. Yeah, the twin cool. turbo Huracan is super cool. Um, the Corrado is awesome. The Drift Stang. The GT350 is really cool, but I wouldn't say it's like super, like top 10 cool. I think best colors goes to the uh, Subaru WRX and that green Corvette. Yeah, green. Oh, that, that green Corvette was. Um, yeah, all right. And then, yeah, I think that's it. All right, I think well, we got it right. Let us know. Let us know how you guys like this. Leave a comment because we're going to keep this video live. So once the live video is done, it's going to get uploaded and then we're going to keep it up there. So leave a comment on the video after as well. All right, guys. Thanks for watching and subscribing. We got cool videos coming up. Uh, don't forget to tell your friends to subscribe. We're trying to get to a yeah. million and that's about it. Come back on Friday. Thank you for your bribes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Thank you very much, guys. Thanks Bye, guys. for tuning in. See ya. Let me just make this flex really big before the screen cuts out.